Hello, stream. We be live. Yo, what's good? This is a... Uh, a Rolf? A Hrolf? Yeah. yeah, that's me. <laughs> what's going on, face? Hrolf. Sup? Not much. Uh, starting the stream, like a chill person. But, uh... Currently waiting on some... Some player technical difficulties. And we'll be back in the semifinals yeah. in a few minutes. Yeah, big surprise. Um... We're hoping that we can butt in here. I don't. I don't think they started, but if they did, it was quick. Like, yeah. I think they just pushed all the buttons. Yeah. I don't think they. I don't think they actually started it. Yeah, because the player I'm looking for is completely offline on Steam and Discord, so no contact. Yeah, it could be that he went. He clicked the offline button on Steam. That'd be unfortunate. Yeah, off, last online two minutes ago, so maybe that's the case. Or a PC restart. Uh, if nothing else, we can we can go to the top game. Yep. But that's gonna be probably YouTube. thirty minutes from now. Uh, probably more like twenty. Yeah. As I see, Misfits just updated their score. Wait, yeah, they're winning. Misfits has advanced. Uh huh. But uh, I'm pretty excited. There's so many teams. Yeah, man. 44. 44 teams. Uh, already some surprises. 5Ds of Hoops got knocked down to the bottom bracket where they just beat Broderick's team. That's, Multiple uh, that, scoregasms. That, that's Camber and Big Jack. To lose. That's Camber yeah. and Big Jack, if you don't know. They're big, very, very experienced ranked Hoops members. Some of the OG members. They're used to climbing their way up from the bottom. So right now they're playing Hoops Moi Lassac. I'm sure I didn't pronounce that right, but that's the uh, the Canadian French guys, Cook and Iguan. That should be a good game. We won't get to watch that, but uh, whoever wins that, you know that they they played real hard to get there, even though it's just the best of one. All luck, no skill. Unsurprisingly, just dominating the uh, top side of the bracket. Uh, who did they? They took a loss to the Barnacle Boys. Uh, who? Super interesting. The Barnacle Boys. They they took a two three loss game one, the very first game they played. What, what team are you talking about? All luck, no skill versus the Barnacle Boys. Barnacle Boys is oh. uh, wax, wax and shadow. Yeah, well, they were real close games. Oh yeah, they they took a game actually. Wow. I didn't realize. Yeah, those were close. Three to one. Three to two. Two to three. Oh. I'm going to try to jump in there because they reported the game and they verified the game results. Oh, yeah, they did. All right, let's 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 be quick. Hopefully it's not in the middle of it because it hasn't recently, but it's known to occasionally screw them up. Oh, we totally jumped right in the middle of the game. That guy's got a million ping. All right, he has five frames five per second. Five FPS. Okay. This is really sad. We just got in the middle of the game where they they're and like staring at each other. Are they gonna redo? Yeah. I hope. Mm. Yeah, currently, players are uh, risk Take air dribble. He's about to savage on him with an air dribble. Just actually, out. actually misses. Okay. Uh, maybe... This is the unfortunate truth of uh, of online play. Occasionally, you get internet problems. Yeah, Kennedy. He's to leave. Kennedy, was that Kennedy that had five FPS? Yeah, Does that, that might explain what that, that that probably explains why we weren't able to get into the match. And I see, I hear a notification. They call me Wolf tier thirty. Thank you, Wolf. They said whatever. All right, I guess they're restarting. We'll leave. We'll rejoin. What'd you say about Wolf? Uh, Wolf donated 30 bits. Oh, that's sick. Let me check so we know the... it works. Can you check the, the... I don't know if he sent a message with it. Can you check the... Uh, the, uh, the thingy? The thingy thingy thing? Yeah. Yeah. But a hell, hell is stream. Thanks for tuning in. Nope, no message. No message, Savage Wolf. Speechless. That's what I'm gonna, what I'm gonna say. He's speechless. 
All right, let's try to rejoin the room. We almost joined in time. We were only like 10 seconds late. Savage. The game has started. Wait, that's, were, you, were you in the same game the whole time? No. I they left. Must have, they must have left again. Well, it's a good thing I didn't switch to... Yep, Kennedy is not just now offline again. Oh, maybe he is restarting. And I got dragged into another game. Okay. Yep, same guys. Here we go. All finally, right. Finally. Finally yeah, back yeah, in. Yeah, finally. This. All right. I don't know a lot about these teams. I know you know Kennedy, but this is completely new for me. These guys clawed their way to the semifinals. Bambi's going to take a shot. Oh, just off the rim. Karma Juni. Is that is that right? Karma Juni? Car Karma. Let me check. We'll call it that. Bambi is going to take it down. That definitely He's Karma Juni. upset Jr. at what happened to his mother. <laughs> Kind of up to the wall where Karma Jr. is waiting for the save, but he passes it down to Bambi. It goes off the waterfall! Straight in. Early goal. That's unfortunate that Karma, Karma Jr. didn't get the scoop he wanted. Totally Bambi. not fixing the overlay right now. Oh. <laughs> Friendship right. kickoff? I don't expect any of those to happen. Uh, I did. Kennedy does know it. I know that is confirmed oh, yeah? because he did it with me. That's oh, that was such that was such a close shot. It was. Kennedy sending that to the wall. Oh, a little bit of bumping from a red boom team from Risk. Each other. That's a shot, but oh, it's straight in. I thought that was gonna bounce off of the rim I, and go I, out. I definitely thought Kennedy was gonna save that, getting so close on the replay. Mm -hmm. Tucks it right into the corner. Instead of going up and out, it just loses all its momentum. I think Eases Karma. Right Car in. I think Karma could have actually saved that had uh, he jumped earlier. All right, once again, no friendships, no surprise. Oh, Kennedy's going to go for the aerial here. He's trying to pass it up to his teammates. His teammates cross, though. Bambi's what bumped. a bump! Yeah, had a lot of power and emotion, you know? <laughs> yeah. Back at Bambi for scoring last time. Kennedy has accidentally set it up. Ooh, that could have been a double touch. That risk waterfall attempt was almost, almost capable. Mm -hmm. Bambi... Tries to 50 50 Gets around, but Bambi it's again. Into him. He's trapped in Blue's corner. I think Kennedy's got the the upper hand on this, but no, he lets it go. I think he didn't have enough boost. Risk is going to air dribble it towards the middle of the goal. Karma Jr. pre jumping that save. Yeah, Kennedy was out of boost Kennedy there. passes forward. This is a dunk. No, man, Risk. Using the wall to save the ball. On that, on that air dribble, Risk, Risk all, all Risk had to do was actually get in our touch on the ball because Karma was the only person who could save it. Kennedy was out of boost. Mm-hmm. Karma Juni desperately trying to get it out of the corner. Sends it over to Kennedy's side. Kennedy. Oh, I thought he was going to clear. He sets it down. Back down into the corner. They're playing defensive, but they're going to run out of time if this keeps up. Risk double touch. But the Karma gets bumped. Bambi wants a double touch, but he set it too high for himself to get. That rim bounce is going to go right back to middle. Kennedy didn't have a read on it. And he gets bumped. Risk setting it up for Bambi. Bambi trying <laughs> trying desperately for that aerial way up there, but didn't have enough boost. Karma Juni bouncing it off the rim. That's an attempted shot, I think. Send it back to Bambi with another attempted shot. Here's a here's an air dribble in, maybe. Risk taking his time. Kennedy gets rim. You see that second hit that Risk had right here? Yeah. Knocked his car way back so he couldn't get another hit on it. He tries to get in front of it to block, but he, he didn't uh, He could have. He did have the boost, and he did. He just didn't go for it. He could have uh, kept aiming towards the ball, but he didn't. Yeah, that touching the ball disrupted him so much. All right. Kennedy's going to try to aim and shoot at this. Wow. Bullet. Bambi Laser not beam. expecting anything yeah. along those lines. A kickoff goal. Yeah, nice and easy. Slow goal. He had plenty of time to line it up. He uses it all. All right, this kickoff position, not much to say here, except depending on who goes for it, it can get launched really fast. Yeah, uh, if, you, if you got if you got the same side kickoff, if one team goes right and one team has the left person, you know, it can uh, launch. I'm sorry, guys, I totally missed that goal, but Risk popping it up, driving up the wall and firing it forward. Uh, those shouldn't be scored because defenders got the advantage on the back wall. They just were out of rotation and out of boost, I think. Risk, knowing that I'm watching, 
uh, spamming camera reverse. <laughs> Risk is up for this. I don't think he's high enough yet. Fakes. Goes down. Air dribble attempt. Here's a pass, maybe. Oh, he's got a shot. With 12 boosts. That's all you need, apparently, is... 18 actually boost. Yeah. Blue team both went for boost. One for the side, one for the corner. It put him in a really bad position to save that ball. Yeah, boost over ball every time. Risk still spamming camera. <laughs> Enjoying that heavily. Hey, that's a nervous tick. I've done that before. It's just... You just got nothing to do while you're waiting for the what a save by risk. ball to get launched into the air. Ambi's popped it up, but this is dangerous. Risk gets the save, and actually it's going towards the net. Could have been a uh -huh. really dangerous pinch. I don't expect the players to be able to read the net in these situations. That's uh, Even I can't read the net in a lot of situations. But to use it as a, a form of passing or clear is uh, is foreign to a lot of uh, non-hoops yeah, players. The, Rolf being a savage there, the ego coming out. But <laughs> but I, I'm going to be honest, you're a good player. I believe in you. But, I just mean that like... Oh, Kennedy! The pool bump! Yeah. I just mean that if, uh, if the ball is fired at the rim really quickly, soccer it's really hard for players that yeah. have the read where it's going to go. Yep. And the, and all these players are soccer mains. I know Kennedy definitely is. Had a talk with him a few days ago. And That's going to go in. Ooh. Did, wait. <laughs> Bambi just saved that, right? From uh, Blue's goal? Yes. I, I do yeah. believe so. I was actually he, he watching Bambi. Off the rim, yeah. It was so confusing that I didn't even like notice it when I was watching Bambi. I was just confused. Kennedy forced to pinch it to get it around Bambi, and uh, Bambi just let him do whatever he wanted. Risk aerial. Risk. Yeah, this is uh, really dangerous for Orange. They're just pop popping it really high. Now they both got no boost, but uh, blue team is being timid. They, uh, they saw red in the air, and they didn't want to chase after it. Risk is using the ceiling here. Oh, man. Wait, blue, is that? Both blue team members up. Wait, that's actually alpha boost from Karma Juni. And Alpha Wheels. I'm not using Alpha Console. Oh, you're right. That's actually the Alpha stuff. Holy. Did not There's expect. A demo from Bambi. Risk is going to lay it down from a Bambi doesn't have any boost. He's just going to tap it into the wall 30 times. Going to grab the boost from the corner. Karma Juni sends it across. A pitch. Bambi's using the ceiling. Ooh, but a... Kennedy hits it out. He's in the wall in a good spot. Risk. Risk. Dangerous yeah. put down. Yeah, he tapped it away from Karma Juni, though. Otherwise, it would have been a goal, I think. Yeah, he was already going in, but he just put it down. Now that's dangerous. And Karma Jr. Yeah, misses! going in again. This time for Brazil. So we... Orange team... Uh, I believe that's team last minute. They've proven yep. that they can score. <laughs> they can score a lot. No, actually, that's... Uh, yeah, Orange team is team last minute. And KK on blue. Makes sense. They got the double K names. Yep. I saw an attempted friendship from blue team there. Hey, I did, we missed something. Sluice subscribed with Twitch Prime. Thank you, Nico. Oh, sick. Yeah, I was going to get that open, but the game started soon. Sorry about that. I'll, I'll make sure that our notifications are up to date. You can count on me. Now, that first game, orange team showing blue team a little bit, a little bit too much aggression there, I think. Uh, I mean, I've, I've seen teams just throw their second games. After after going all out the first game, freaking Nico straight up steam messages me. Shout out the recent subs, dude. Oh. You're the that's you. <laughs> you're a savage. It's it's it's, it's, ju it's just you. It's with it's, Twitch Prime. We appreciate it, but I mean, I mean, like you're you're the mod here. Like you oh oh, I hear something. What is this? Oh, bit a single bit. Oh, <laughs> Negative this is shit. Be nonstop. The, yeah, I should have put a limit on that. The rain. For now, the, there's no limit. He, I don't. He said, uh, Craigasm won Twitch Affiliate. Mm -hmm. Oh no, oh no! Here we go. Can oh. we get a three? Somebody give me three. Three, going once, going twice. I'm not three, even gonna... Three, somebody give me three. <laughs> I'm, I'm leaving the match to, to just time Dude, out. Bassy, that's one. <laughs> oh no, it's begun! He said, let's go. <laughs> what have we done? Alright, here goes again. Oh god, Kennedy, Kennedy also- Oh no! My ears! Every time! <laughs> Kennedy and Bambi at the kickoff. Kinda went towards blue side here. Bambi accidentally touching it away from Risk. Kennedy Bambi's with- control it. Knocks it around Karma Juni. Popped in the blue corner. Is a tap up? Nope, just to the right. Nice slow play early on. Kennedy has a that's shot. Good, that's a goal attempt. 
Oh, what a oh, save! Wow. Yeah, risk. Pulling that one. Four bits Maybe coming in. Oh, we're up to four bits with a kappa from Sassy Pig. Dude, it hurts getting all these pennies thrown at us. <laughs> it hurts. Throw us <laughs> some softer chains, please. <laughs> risk <laughs> with a shot. Is it a second touch? Dunk! Oh. What a dunk! They're, they're dropping them from the Empire State Building and it's hurting. Mm. That looks so much better in slow motion, dude. They're, they're building up. We've got nickels now. Alright. Uh, I think both teams got that kickoff down. Nothing weird there. I've seen a lot of uh, people who haven't played hoops at all that are unfamiliar with it. They wait on their boost. And they think that's fine until they start getting booped by the better players. Oh, that's just going to go in. Yeah, Bambi couldn't understand how to save that. Yeah, check it out. Kennedy with just a roll shot. And it also happens to roll along the rim. I don't think I'd be able to save that either. Unless I got it early on the wall. But uh, yeah, Risk got rimmed. Rimmed pretty hard. The consistent pennies being thrown at us is <laughs> savage. It's nonstop. Oh, there it is. Oh, about swoosh 500 bits. A nice, fi like a nice, comfy $5 bill thrown at you. <laughs> Doesn't hurt as much as a freaking nickel and dime. Wolf. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. Did not, I did not expect this at all. <laughs> but they're all welcome. Thanks a bunch for the bits, guys. Yeah, well, thank you. you. Well, thank you as a group. So we don't have to call out everything. Yeah, yeah. And all of those, of course, are going to go back the to the prize pool. pool. Yep. Uh huh. So we can have more $40 tournaments, Co hopefully. Ball will not go out. Karma Juni unable to get that any one. height. That did a full horseshoe and back, right? Let's let's watch. Yep. One, two, three, four, five. Yep. Oh, at, okay. at least five rim bounces. Yeah, it just stayed along the side. I thought it went all the way around. All right. Well. Orange team was up this high again last game, and uh, they kept pushing with it. <laughs> they got another three goals afterwards. This is so dangerous, but he doesn't know how to get there. The, the, wall, the wall and ground defense from uh, from blue team is not looking very powerful right now. They Nobody goes see, up for that. You can see Kennedy wasn't setting himself up for, like, clearing the ball off of the rim. He was instead directly underneath it, and that relies on him perfectly reading where the ball is going to go, rather than going to the side or the back post and then jumping over the rim to clear. Rolf 600, thank you. Or Wolf, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Rolf 600, uh, I, every, every time. I do that every time. Yeah, this is those F I, sounds at the I, end. I, I can, no, on I target, can. ooh, really close. Did you see that tip? That was really close. I can never handle casting with you and, Rolf, and Wolf. Uh, see, look at that. I did yeah, it again. Yeah, exactly. Bambi's going to pop it to Kennedy, waiting patiently. That's a shot. That's going to go in, but Risk avoids the rim this time. Risk, it air dribble, air drag, yeah. one, two, three, four. Oh, <laughs> Karma Juni keeping it out. That was really close. Good good on uh, Karma Juni for reading what Risk was uh, putting down there. Kennedy with the flick. Karma Juni uh, doesn't get in a good position to send that into the wall. Kennedy goes Risk, as a demo Risk on Risk. the boost. Kennedy now. The oh, dunk's coming in. No way! Risk pops off of the rim. After a failed attempt at saving it, that's that the ball goes right to him. That's the second toy ball he's say he's gotten. Uh, I don't I don't know where you're going with this risk. He's trying to pinch it with the net, but bumps it's his still teammate? rolling slowly. Now he's out of boost. His teammate's in front of him. Kennedy's got a shot here. It's rolling along the wall. Bambi How clearly he... misses the rim. Keeps it out. Oh, that's on. Oh, it's just wide. Risk, risk up to Bambi. Using that passes the Bambi. Bambi tries to get into the waterfall, but. That was just a little wide for Demo. Him. Kennedy's got a shot. No. All these air drags coming out. I believe that they're they're trying to transition into that hoops main lifestyle. Yeah. They're trying to style on the other team. That was just wide. Bouncing off the rim. Bambi's set up for Kennedy beautifully. Kennedy Six. drops it down. There's no way he can get it. 601 that. from Sassy Pig. Well, or what's this? I can't read what that emote is, but it says New, fight me. <laughs> yeah. New top donator. Sassy Pig. And let, let the top donator fight begin. Alright, two minutes to go. Blue team's definitely in this. They can score. They've uh, they've dropped a couple shots. Karma Juni slams it straight into Bambi. This is still dangerous for Blue. But Kennedy 
deftly avoiding orange team, only to get it bounced right back to his goal. Risk of the bam. No way! Karma Judy also got rimmed, bumped up after the rim. He launched straight upward and saved the ball that way. <laughs> oh god, the bits! 102 sluice ginger power. There's a double tap. Bambi's got the ball in the corner. Pass is a pretty easy to save ball, but blue team is nowhere to be found. Where'd they go? Uh, they're all, they both went for an aerial, a really high aerial. They oh were my just God. locked I'm, out I'm looking position. at chat right now and it's just full of bits. So appreciated everybody, thank you. At this rate, we might be able to get paid. <laughs> uh-huh. Alright, I'm gonna have to message Wolf and see if we can get into the next game. Because they started their first game, which is fine. Yep. We'll just wait for a few minutes. Risk, air dribble attempt, I see it coming. I yeah, see it. You're right. He can't he can't say no to that. Kennedy's there though to block him. Blue team's got a really Kennedy good doink. attempt here now. Karma Juni bops it up, but Kennedy gets bumped. I was expecting Kennedy to go for a doink right there. Yeah. The 50 50. A... <laughs> <laughs> the whiffs and the 50 50 is coming up. Kennedy's got a shot here. Oh, what a no, save. that's not a good save at all. What a save! It sounds. Wow, what a Kennedy's save! Every. In. Every but time! Bambi defends it! Whoa! Risk barely miss- gets missed by Karma Juni using the jump to avoid. Oh, that's really good using the angle there. Take a shot. It goes straight into the corner. That pocket is so savage. It's, it's almost yeah. impossible to save it because you're gonna get rimmed every time and it's just gonna keep bouncing- bouncing down into the rim. Yeah, Kennedy knew exactly how much to jump there to- after the bounce to hit the ball straight into the corner. That kickoff looks pretty standard. The both guys know what they're doing there. Risk, just trying to clear that. But Karma Juni's there. He's trying to dunk it again. No, they've only got 20 seconds to score two goals. The odds are stacked good. against them. Kennedy's desperately trying to get the ball away from Bambi, knowing that they only have 10 seconds to go. Karma's gonna pass forward. Kennedy's up. Risk is first. Karma Juni puts it up. Last attempt. Risk clears it, no problem. And, oh, that was really close. If Karma Juni had barely rotated a little more, I think that could have been a goal, but that's the end. And that is games. Oh my god, voice crack right that's there. All of them. Team Last Minute has won the first losers. It's winners. Also, Sloosh, mm -hmm. yes, it's a semi final. You fix it. <laughs> wow. <laughs> no, I'm not I'm not taking any any of any of your your garbage right now. All right, I'm messaging Wolf now. Let's see. I'm actually gonna stay in the match and watch some of these some of these plays over. Hey, thanks for the recent follows too, Faux Paws and Jevrov Sweaty. Yep, it means a lot. Wolf says it's about to start now. We can uh, we can join on we him. We can pop right, in. Let's okay, let me yeah, yeah. Uh, let me leave the match right now so we don't get dragged. Weirdly. All right. Let me just put in the information here. Faux pause is in here with a Z and an X. Now that is now that is a yeah. name. That is Faux a name pause. if I've ever seen one. That's clever. It is. All right. This is the match I was pretty excited about. Oh my god. JF2 they... and Legend. They're going. Oh god. No they waiting did... around for these D guys. Just realized they didn't give me time to do the overlay. Feels bad. Oh, I hope you're ready, dude. <laughs> Feels bad. Be quick. Cover me. Taking fire, cover me. Alright. Looks like there's going to be a friendship right off the beginning. Mythic popping it over. Just goes wide, Wolf. 50-50. This is dangerous for Orange, but Mythic pops it over his own goal just to clear it. Wolf now in an awkward position. JF2 trying to take advantage of it, but he, he didn't read the rim. Wolf's got a shot. Mythic. Mythic, can he pinch it down? He was just trying to block, but Legend. he totally faked Legend out there, I yeah, think. Legend didn't... Actually, looking at Legend's point of view, Legend didn't actually read the wall hit. He didn't expect mm, yeah, that. I don't, right. think, I don't think he expected anything out of Mythic. He just didn't read the wall. He was going to have to be quick to get there, too. There was no room for error. 
I know Wolf likes to be sort of slow on those kickoffs to just make sure that no one can get past him, especially with the Merc. Risk. Mythic, gosh. Risk, Once, you're welcome for casting. Every time I look at Mythic's camera set, oh, Wolf just dunked yeah, it in. I didn't think he had it. They're so far away, it's really cringy. Yeah, I have to mention it at least once. I yeah. Asked Mythic. Also, also we have to mention space. Wolf is tryharding. He's in the Merc. Yeah, this is his go-to car if he wants to win. He's he's gonna win that way. All right, that kickoff is going sour for Blue Team. Wolf's in a good position to get this ball right after Legend takes it. I think that's in. It's off of the roof. No, barely short. Mythic now. Oh, that's really unfortunate. Legend just in the wrong spot at the wrong time. Wolf pops it up. He's going to try to take it after that. Bounces too far, I think. Bouncing back in. Right up. Mythic. Mythic's got it. No JF2. way. JF2 is ready on the wall. What a read from JF2. And he gets it over. Oh, Mythic keeping it out. Really good defense from the all luck, no skill team. The flight is, uh, is our blue team this time. Yep. Uh, Mythic, I, I don't think he wanted to do that with his dribble, but I think he wanted to take it to the wall. Legends popped it up for JF2. That's going to be a dunk. Very close. Legend even took Wolf out. So oh, all Mythic. JF2 had to do was put that in. Mythic's got a shot. JF2 is going to keep it out, though. Barely. Man, that was close. If Wolf had stayed on the wall there, he could have taken the shot as well. So it's pretty dangerous for Blue Team. JF2's popped it up. Mythic's going for a shot, but he got he uh, blasted a little too high to, to get the ball in goal. Wolf is taking an attempted clear. Is he going to pinch this? Very close. He, there's no way that ball had enough height, though. He was just really hoping, crossing his fingers. Legend's got a shot. It's just a little high. He's popped it over to Wolf nicely, so he can set it up. Wolf's going to try to pass the Mythic here, I think. No, he's going to take a shot right into the... What a pinch! ...opening of the goal, yeah. JF2 with a Rolf style. I'm calling that a Rolf style. Yeah, I see you doing it. That's the only way it. you could have saved that. Mythic with a nice and easy shot straight to the front of the goal. From the wall. Those pin pinches I've seen come out really strong recently. I've seen a lot of clips recently with a lot of pinches. I have some of my own. And, I mean, they're, they're becoming a meta, really. Pinches are becoming the meta. A lot of the times, you don't have enough time to save it nice and clean. You've got to pinch it against the rim to save it. But, uh... Mythic and Wolf, uh, they're playing some really, really good solo play. I haven't seen any passes yet. That's what I want to see from them. We're all uh, waiting. Legend and JF2, however, they've, they've got some over-the-rim over the net passes, but they haven't been able to get them away from the defense yet, so hopefully they can use their teamwork to their advantage. Guards are getting bumped by his teammate, has no boost. It's really dangerous. Legends shot it up to his wall. Ooh, if that didn't roll down like that, that would have been in goal. It's still a sort of in goal, but Legends got enough time to save it. That's gonna roll up, but not enough for Legend to score. Wolf and Mythic now a total possession. JF2. Wolf's got a shot. Mythic's following. JF2 pops it up out of danger. Yeah, JF2 running running low on boost, actually zero. Really dangerous. Blue team has been out of boost and out of position this whole game from, from what Wolf's I've just, seen. Wolf's just letting Legend have that while he takes and lines up a shot. JF2 just keeping it out. The pressure from Orange team is really good right now. They're just forcing Blue team to stay inside goal and slowly running them dry from boost. This is the clear yep. the Blue team needed, though, to get their aggression going. Legend's going to try to pass it to JF2. That's a really good pass, but just a little short for JF2 to... Nicely pop that up. Mythic's got a good block, but JF2's keeping it out. Mythic, I don't like Mythic's location here. Mythic, it, it, there's no way Wolf can get it to him between two defenders. Just kind Wolf. of comes with time and experience, understanding when they can make a pass and when they can't. Mhm. Mm yeah, I don't think they've played together that much. They've definitely played together a little bit for you know maybe four or five hours total. Oh, the Why shot! Not? That oh, that's that 50-50 right off of the ceiling. Lands right at the front of the rim, but bounces straight in. So right here, not really a 50-50, I guess. Uh, uh, JF2 I, attempted a block. No, Camber. Just went really wrong. Just no. Just no. Let's not begin <laughs> not again. this again. <laughs> He's testing, dude. Testing. 100%. Right. Legends requested that after this round that he restarts Rocket League. He's, uh, a, he's lot of, a lot problems. of technical difficulties today. From Kennedy no. to, to Legend. Yeah, guys. Normally we wouldn't start, uh, we wouldn't start one semifinal after another, but that's just the way the bracket went. We didn't hold the matches. We just jumped in in the middle of them. We w we were thinking about holding, but it, we didn't need to. Mhm. Mm Wolf's gonna try to pop it up for Mythic, but Mythic uh, missed the boost, so he wasn't there in time. 
JF2's hit the corner. I don't think that's going to be enough. Legend's going to pop it up for JF2, though. JF2, does he have enough boost? He does, but Wolf was first. Wolf's knocked it to the corner. Legend's going to hit it right to him, right into his hands. JF2, flick! Those Batmobile yeah. flicks, too powerful. Yeah. No way! Well, Legend's up already! Wolf barely making that out. What a save I indeed. Thought that, I thought that play was going to be their play. Their yeah, I saw it too. That's what they need. They need a shred of hope that they can score against this really defensive team. Yeah, Wolf, known for his back wall defense by, by many players. And, and his pre-jumping defense. <laughs> <laughs> Pre yeah, true. So it... the It seems like the theme of these games is a lot, a lot of 50-50s just contesting everything and then orange team just playing it really safe and counter-attacking. As all no right. skill wins the first of three. We'll wait for a legend to restart his computer and then, uh, or restart his Rocket League, I think. And while he does that, do you need to fix the overlay? Your overlay looks good to me. I, I did, I did fix it. I fixed it while you were casting. At the beginning of the match. Mm-hmm. Thanks for the follow, Chumba3. Mythic I'm, I'm missed try. the boost. Okay, okay, Camber. Okay. Yeah, I see what you did there. That's good. I want to try to hold off the uh, follow, follow callouts and bit callouts till in between matches okay. if we can. That way we can focus on the gameplay. Indeed. Uh, what? Legend still isn't back yet, but we can wait. The hell is that? Uh, the capitalization there, there, the camber with the the A's. Uh, caps lock. No, that's how it's spelled. <laughs> that's how it's spelled. Is that a BTTV? Mhm. Mm Indeed. I don't have BTTV. I probably should. Yeah, it's good. Cause then I know when they're actually memeing me, and I don't know it. All right, game number two. Your blue team is down a goal or down a game. All right, starts off nothing surprising, no fakes. No, Mythic those... is gonna slowly take this to the wall, but JF2 saw that coming, getting that demo. JF2 in. looks like he's had a boost. Oh, never mind. Just waiting, gets trolled me. JF2, yeah, rolls the ball up the rim there of the net. That's a really good way to pass, but lately I haven't had much luck in scoring using that. Unless it's going like really, really fast. That just goes in. Mythic, he's just flabbergasted underneath the net. It's those camera settings. Totally. Yeah, it's out of me, dude. <laughs> yeah, not reading at those bounces because your camera is too far away from your car. Yeah, from his camera angle, he couldn't see the, the ball location on the floor. Well, I guess you couldn't anyway, but uh, I think he needed to possibly turn ball cam off there just for a second to see where the ball was going. That, that sideways French. Oh, the fake from Wolf. Mm-hmm. He's gonna take up the wall. Mythic's gonna take it from there. I don't. I don't know if I like that. Wolf gives gives him the opportunity to go get boost though, and uh, continue to keep the pressure up. JL JF2 Boomer. though, he's got a shot. Mythic, does he have? Yeah. There's it to the wall. JF2's gonna take a shot as well. Wolf doesn't have it. Wow. Wolf is in a good position on the wall, but I think he was backwards. Let's see. He was just nope, too nope. high. He's ready. He was just too high. Mm-hmm. You're right. He didn't expect uh, JF2's nice low shot. The flight is up two goals. Already with less than a minute in. I'm telling you, that no first way. that first game might be a throw might be uh might be a victory for Orange, but they might be throwing now. Yeah. JF2 it looks like he booped off the kickoff. Booped it right over Mythic. A little bit Mythic more advanced. To take a shot, but he was a little too far forward. He's gonna pass to Wolf now, back pass. But it gets intercepted by both blue team members. <laughs> Legends pass to JF2. JF2 can't quite connect with the ball. There's another 50-50 in Wolf's favor. Leaving it for Wolf. And now that is why you don't leave the ball. Yeah, See? Wolf in the corner just taking his time, lining up this nice little shot. Way too and far using away. using that corner. Mm -hmm. Because of uh, the angle he hit it at, it just goes really nice straight into the center of the goal. I think uh, I think the defense was looking to a wall to clear. Let's see what Wolf's got in store here. He's taking it nice and slow, even though he's got tons of boost. He knew he had plenty of time before Legend got there. Pops it 
right over his head. That slow game. Yeah, Barely. Legend, uh, Legend had eight boost, and he missed the middle boost pad. And that would have given him enough boost to get there in time, I think. Because, you know, Wolf was taking his time. Yeah. I think he could have capitalized off of that to get that oh, save. Oh, but... that boop right over Wolf. It just goes to show that uh, a small 12 boost pad can mean a, a world of difference. Gotta get those pennies. Yeah, we've been getting those pennies nonstop. <laughs> Throw to their faces. Mythic sends it into the corner to pop it up. Pops out for Wolf again. Wolf taking a shot straight into the front of the goal. Really good pass from Mythic. That uh, I didn't expect Wolf to use the rim like that. I, I think he was trying to shoot, but it still worked out in the end. Mm -hmm. uh, it's worked out as a pass to Mythic, who gave it back to Wolf. All right, this kickoff going evenly, but Wolf's up in the air for it. With I think he's gonna shot. take his time. It's just gonna go right in. That's not good. Uh, Blue's even Blue's defense is lacking. I think. I, I, I take it back. I, Orange team is not throwing. They're actually just trolling. Yeah. <laughs> They're thro throwing two, throwing two shots, and then, and then the rest is win. Yeah, these guys definitely don't let a couple goals get to them, especially in the first minute. They return with four goals in the next. <laughs> hey, you, I'll one up you, <laughs> you know. Hey, you got two goals. I'll score two in the same amount of time. Two yeah. more than you. Two additional ones. Oh, JF2's two has got a read. Oh man, it's really close. I thought JF2 was actually gonna workout. get the hit before that one. That's going to begin. I, Wolf, his accuracy, once again, shining. He, he's missed, I don't think he's missed a single, like, on-target goal. Anytime he's had an open net, he's taken the opportunity. And, Mythic just and, uh, don't get JF2. Yeah, mm -hmm. he's, it's all, it's all just powerful enough that it'll hit the rim to troll the other team. But not powerful enough that it'll bounce up, dangerously. Yeah. It's, uh, Mythic was just there for insurance. It sounds a lot like my insurance. You know, it's, it, maybe it's there. <laughs> maybe it's there to cover me. <laughs> Legend just got bumped out of the save there. Let's look from Mythic's perspective. You can see he, he's he been doing this a lot with his aerials. He flies really high and then realizes he's too high and has to duck down. And, yeah, those shots are those shots back. look really cool, but are actually uh, actually really dangerous because they usually go way over the rim. Oh, that that's a really unfortunate kickoff. JF2 keeps it out. I think Wolf saw that coming, but wasn't high enough to dunk it in. Mythic managing JF2, to beat boost. that. Uh-huh. Let's see. Legend now. He's got control of the ball. Wolf hits it over. JF2 is going to take that opportunity to grab the 100 boost. Hits it towards Mythic. No. Wolf hits it against the wall. It gives him another possession. That's going to be a it. shot, even. JF2! What a sick save. Last minute. Manages to get underneath the ball. I think Legend was trying to do a roll-up there. One of those pinch roll-ups. Yeah, yeah, I think you're right. JF2, I thought, was trying to control the ball, but accidentally hit it way too hard right into Wolf. Now he's got no boost. Finds the boost in the corner. Legend, though, taking a shot, bumping Wolf out of the way. This this game is getting really scrappy. It Blue is. team trying, resorting to violence. <laughs> <laughs> Wolf <laughs> Just to bumping. get some goals in. Oh, I see a pathway here. Wolf, unable to get a touch on that. Feels bad, man. Mythic's pass to Wolf. Wolf. Oh, I, like I said, I, I, he's going to be really accurate, but that time the accuracy just wasn't there. I think he had enough time to shoot. Maybe he didn't know Legend didn't have any boost. Legend's got a really good shot. Wolf popping it just up with a, a nice double jump save. Mythic pinching it into the corner, but now the ball is doomed to stay in the corner. Is Wolf going to try to shoot with the ceiling? No. Just takes a little touch. Really light hand there. Plays the ball into the goal. The defense, uh, Legend decided to blast up for it, which I think was the right move. But uh, JF2, I think, expected Legend to make something happen there. It's looking Mythic, pretty hopeless for that, Blue Team. Mythic, that cheat up was actually really risky. Off that kickoff. I don't like those. I know you I love do. them. I, love I know it. you love them, but I don't like them. They're, I feel like they're too. They sometimes go a little bit too far backwards. I mean, if the it's all about establishing your zone of control in the very beginning. If you want a lot of early pressure, 
cheating up on the kickoff just increases your zone of control by that yep. much. I mean, even if they hit it, even if you lose on the kickoff, it's still your ball. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Th at that point, it's you up get, to you. You get a chance to make a shot, and then they have to go for a defense. No, I mean, if, if the ball goes to your side, you have control at least. And, yeah. Uh, it doesn't get out of control. Like, it's not you're not in a position where the other team is going to shoot ever. Oh, that's a good one. I just got that popped high. JF2, though, was clear on the other side of the court. I think this is going to spell the end of this game and the series. And that will be the second semifinal going to all all skill, all luck, no skill. All luck, no skill. I, I almost said all skill, no luck. Dang. Wolf there with the own goal just to finish it off. Yeah, that was pretty... Uh, Really timely. I don't think he had any moments to spare to get that own goal. 111. Uh, JF2. JF uh, I mean, sorry. The flight, I think they have a really good chance of coming back up through the loser's bracket. Yep. They're looking, they looking really strong, especially against this this, this high level how of a gameplay of a team. Hey, thanks for the host, Big Dog. PC Gamer Gabe. Dude, that's my name. That's me. Some guy's got a Twitch account with my Who, name. Whose name? Did you know my name is Gabe? PC. Gabriel? No, I did not. Well, while we're saying this, my name is Nick. So, yeah. Wow. I didn't know that. We're getting, we're getting, we're getting really close now. Wow. One stream and we're already uh, on, on first base. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You've got a moment to change your overlay. And uh, hey, thanks, Revy77, for the follow as well. The worst part is I can't actually change the overlay until I know what's going on. <laughs> until I know which team is orange team. It feels bad. Uh, taking a quick look at the bracket, it looks like uh, the five Ds of Hoops actually got knocked out by Iguan and Cook's team. Hoops, Moore, Lasak. They're now playing in losers round six. <laughs> Camber, you're correct. Cor Camber corrected me. First name basis, not first base. <laughs> oh no! Sloosh calling out the uh, calling out bipolar in chat. As I'm about to get some jams rolling while we're waiting for the loser semifinal, which is actually going to be casted because it's going to be a while. Uh, tempted to actually cast a loser's quarterfinal between uh, between probably uh, who would it be? Would it be the top or the bottom one? What? The, the loser top team is always going to be orange. Loser's quarterfinal. Oh, loser's quarterfinal. Because we might actually have to cast one. Because this is such a big tournament, we've got so many people. No, there's no, we, there's no way we're gonna get the chance to cast the quarterfinal. I think that that's gonna uh, advance their best of ones. We gotta you, cast the winners final first. True. I think it'll be winners final, losers final. We'll probably have a little break there between those two. May, games. Maybe an interview. Mm. Delicious. Now nah, we better leave the players alone. You know. Let them, let them chill. Let, let them. Stop stretching them out by uh, trying to make them like yeah. nervous that they're gonna lose. Yeah, hitting a hitting a ball with a rocket powered car is easy. Answering questions, it's not very easy. All yep, right. solution chat telling us telling them to wait for the casters. You are correct, sir. Don't be that guy <laughs> who uh, makes us join in a game while it's in progress. It's really you awkward ready, for face? everybody. You ready to join? Uh, yeah, let me change my overlay. Just let me know when you're ready. All luck, no skill I'm versus ready. team last minute. Hey, thanks Redtail TV for the follow. You are ready? Yep. Alright, here we go. This is also going to be a best of three in the winner's final. Yep. All luck, no skill versus team last minute. This should be really good. 
they're, they're gonna they might actually need that luck though you know they might have they yeah. might have to they might have to like dip into the reserves of luck a little it's bit that's all they got dude but uh glad that they're waiting for us to uh to start the all game right. and they're also waiting for their opponents <laughs> they're also savage savage Thank, right, you the versus... Thank you for the sub. Thank you for the sub, Karma Juni. While we're waiting. Oh, dude, Karma Juni. Yo, you guys played really well. Yeah, you did. Enjoy the new emotes, indeed. Wait, we have emotes? What? Is that a thing? Please tell me that's a thing. We just have one, I think. Please, I want to see these. Let me see these. Aw, sadly, I can't actually see what what the emotes are gonna be. No, you said Kappa. I don't think it. We had to get it approved first, but we we submitted it. We so submitted. I was oh, okay. Just wondering if it, if maybe we did get it. Lynch friend, just subscribe to Twitch Prime. Thank you. Dude, Lynch friend, what's good, dude? Face doesn't understand Kappa. Uh, actually, uh, Kappa, 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 Kappa. I speak Kappa. Here we go. Bambi and Risk. Versus Mythic, Pink Mist, and Wolf. This should be good. Uh, I don't think it'll be a complete stomp. I think uh, Risk and Bambi are going to actually prove difficult for the Hoops vets. I mean, Risk right. Risk has shown that he can aerial. <laughs> he can aerial a whole lot. A whole lot, yeah. <laughs> Bambi's got a shot. Wolf's ready. Risk going to Mythic. Something out. Mythic. But that was not even a fake. That was Risk just... ac accidentally using his car to... T up wolf shot. It was just high. Risk's got a shot. Ooh. That's I thought sad. that was going to be a really good Oh, dunk. back to Risk. Up. That's going to be in. Wolf, can you get there in time? Bambi actually mythic. hit it out, I think. No, no, mythic. no mythic. It was just Mythic. Mythic got it? Yeah. All right, nice. Mythic double touched it out. Oh, that's that's real slick. Risk going to keep it low while on D. That's a, that's a good strategy. Oh, man. You know, keep the ball low on your half, and uh, you'll never get scored on. <laughs> mythic getting faked Risk. out by Risk. Yeah, faked out for the, maybe the third time. Yeah, probably third time at this point. Oh my Just god, the jump. doink! Mythic was ready for it, though. This is a really good counterattack opportunity for Orange. No, actually, I think they're low on boost. Yeah, Wolf is really low. He's popped up for a Mythic. I think he's going to try for another one, even though he doesn't have any boost. No, what went wrong? Wolf, Wolf just bumped him, I, I think. Let's watch this. I'm not sure. Let's watch from Wolf's um, perspective. I'm watching from Risk. Risk goes up. Oh, you're right! I didn't actually see that. Wolf didn't even see Risk on the camera. Right. There's, yeah, it, he had no clue. His, his, ca his camera flipped around way too fast. Which is even worse! Alright. Oh, no, that's a shot. That was really close. Risk. Pops it. It's risky. Mythic's got a shot. That's risky? Just oh, one. my God. Yeah, yeah. No. No. Uh, just, just stop. <laughs> <laughs> Mythic, uh, I don't think Mythic's had a lot of success going straight up for the ball. Uh, not as much as Wolf, but once again, I have to commend Wolf on his accuracy. Uh, Mythic, I think Mythic's got the, oh, at least Bambi. the rotation down, but he gets dunked by Bambi flying over the net. Oh man, that tennis ball, give him the power. Yeah, right into him. Bambi a mind reader. This is the first and ten I've seen in a long time, to be fair. Oh, that's going to go straight in, too, if Risk doesn't have it. Risk batting it away without any problem. No, this is really dangerous. It Wolf is. pops it straight up. Risk is out of boost and backwards. Mythic oh, pinches no. it. Wait, no. What? Wait, what? Both blue team members pinched it. Uh, okay, game. Well, yeah, Wolf pops it straight up. Oh, wait. And, uh, but I, I, it looked like Mythic touched it, but... Camera settings. Definitely the camera settings. <laughs> Here comes another friendship. Mythic pops it over. Right over Bambi. That's Showing dangerous. Showing off that with ease. Mythic trying to pass it to Wolf, but Blue Team is just... What a shot from tripping Wolf. Tripping him up, getting in the way. That's out. Bambi ensures it's out. Mythic trying to get it center for Wolf. Risk is trying to air dribble. I think not finding uh, the right path under the ball for that. Bambi's waiting patiently for his turn. Mythic now is trying to take it. No, Bambi demos. Risk air dribble. I see it happening. Gets one, two, yeah, three. Yeah, no way. Oh, it's still out. 
Bambi up and over, but there's no defense for him to dunk. This air dribble from Risk, getting it right around Wolf. Yep. And then the pinch from the wall. I think, uh, I don't know if Mythic would have had that if he didn't pinch it on the wall, but... It would it would have been a lot harder. Uh-huh, here comes another friendship. It's two to two, and two and a half minutes to go. It's anybody's game. Risk with a boom. Over to Bambi. Bambi passing it back to Risk. Risk pops it up, but Wolf is bumping him out of the way. Wolf, I think he missed that shot opportunity right there. I think he meant to take a shot there. That would have been really hard from that angle. He actually, no, he actually overshot it. He overangled it. Wolf using that wall defense. Mythic All trying right. to get, use the corner to get it center, but there's no power with it. Mythic's alone on defense and bumped. Oh, if that shot was on target, man, that would have been a goal. No yeah, problem. if Risk had been able to read that, that rim bounce, that could have been an amazing play from Bambi and Risk. Uh-oh, that's dangerous from Bambi. Wolf couldn't find the avenue to score from, though. Wolf is up. He's got a touch, but it's still out. Bambi Blue team looks the like they're out. They're low on boost. At least Bambi is. Wolf and Wolf and Mythic have been do have been doing a really good job this tournament on like boost starving their teams, mm -hmm. keeping up the, the aggression. Yeah, that's the benefit of having just constant pressure is that you get to have the, all the boosts in the court if you want. Wolf's gonna take it up the wall, but he's used his flip, so Risk can take this out to his net. Uh, if it were me, I would have pinched it, but he probably doesn't know. Probably doesn't know about those savage rim pinches. Yeah. Yeah. It, it really, I mean, it's crazy when you think about yeah. it. Yeah. It puts it straight to the straight goal. Straight on it's not, the... it's not even like straight forward. It's just like on target. <laughs> yeah. Bambi's got a shot here using the corner, but it's too close to the wall. Mythic reads that with ease. Wolf up Wolf the Mythic. to Mythic. Does Mythic have a dunk? He does, but Bambi deflecting it. Wow. What a read from Bambi. Had to come in like a wrecking ball to save that. Wolf taking both of the left side or right side boosts for him to uh, keep boost away from Bambi there, but Bambi found Orange's corner boost. Mythic with a shot trying to use the wall. Wolf's going to take it up the wall, but I think Bambi might be first. Yeah. Oh, that that's really dangerous. Pinch. That's so And ri Risk actually, I believe he blocked Mythic from rotating back fast enough. Let's watch this. Yeah. Yeah, he, he went for Mythic. But it looks like... Alright. Orange team down a goal with 20 seconds to go. That's going to be real tough. Blue team showing that uh, Double. their defense isn't as good, but it's it's enough. It's enough to hold them against, uh, against weak passing plays. I don't think uh, Orange team, it's going to be enough for Orange team to win this game at least. Mythic gets one bump. That's going to go down. Game one goes to Bambi and Risk. With team last minute. First one. Oh, that's right. Last minute. I keep forgetting their team name. Rolf's fake laugh is golden. Uh, I don't think that hey, was a fake I laugh. I didn't laugh fake. Hey, man. I just what? need something to drink. I'm thirsty. There's a, there's a clip in chat. I have no idea what that is. I've been talking for the last hour, right? You're, you're, you're pulling a me. Oh, they're trying to get a server selection. Oh, uh, no, their orange team is offering to have a US East server. But uh, team last minute the, is saying the ping, West is The fine. pings are really random. Like, they, it's it's strange that they have that ping. Because yeah, because the, the majority of the players have bad ping. So you'd think that they would have chosen a different server. Yeah. I think maybe it wasn't discussed in chat. I didn't see any discussion on it. All right, game number two. Team last minute, your blue team. Up a, up a single game. Mythic is going to try to use that corner trickery. Oh, fakes risk out that way. Oh, no, I didn't see that bounce coming. I'm experiencing surprisingly low frames right now. It's back to normal. When, when, you're, when your frames are below, are below 80, that's not normal for me. Mm. <laughs> so I apologize for if there was any stuttering in chat. You can probably see it more than I can. So that's a really cheeky goal in the first five seconds of the game. Mythic. Mythic. Oh, I was going to say, Mythic also not a fan of controlling the ball <laughs> inside of the court. True. 
I think he, they could have cleared that a while ago. Oh, Wolf! Oh, did he? I can't tell if he hit this that. This is dangerous. Bami's right. got a double touch. Ooh, goes right over. Oh, wow. Wolf used Risk's bump to actually give him the boost. Mm hmm. Both orange team members Mythic. on the wall there. But Mythic's got a shot. Bami can't get it out. Uh, I, Bami I, I, no would, boost. I love this pass from Wolf because he, he actually got bumped by Risk and he knew he was going to, so he used his jump right after to boost into the to boost. Into the boost I believe. Mm. And then he went up the wall and had more speed. Hashtag blame Risk. Don't blame Risk. He's he's really good. They're, those guys are playing really well. They are. For me never seeing them before, they're playing really well. They are. Risk especially showing his air dribble capabilities many times. Mythic passing it right into harm's way. The he's pinch. got that ball out though. Oh no. The flip reset. Bambi could have actually put that up again with a well-timed flip reset. Wolf's got a shot. Oh, that's just over. That block was almost disaster for... Uh, blue team. Team last minute. Wolf's got a clear really high in the wall. He's taking his time to try to 50-50 with risk. Mythic overcommitted there. Strategy. Very dangerous. Oh no. Oh, blue team has got a slight miscommunication from the 50-50 into each other and the ball just dies. Mythic passing the Wolf. Wolf can't get the hide he needs. He spent all 100 boosts repositioning there. They maybe spent 20 boosts trying to get that ball, so now he's out. And that boost is not regen in time, and now he's contesting with no boost. And there's the boost that he needed. He got it. That ball has gone sky high. Risk is taking the opportunity just to tap it, but in the process, hands over possession. Risk has got a shot. Oh, it's too low. Bambi. Bambi's got a shot. That's going to be in. Off of the rim. Wolf reads it. Mythic's got a touch. Ball's still high. Bambi... Uses this opportunity to get boost. He's going to fire it over to Wolf, but Mythic intercepts. This isn't good. Mythic basically passed up to Bambi there. Mm hmm. Oh no. Risk air to shot. Oh, <laughs> that could have been really pitch, bad for Orange Team. The pitch save almost coming against them. Yeah. If either one of them was just a little bit higher, that would have been an own goal. And it would have been unsavable at that point. Yeah. Oh no. That rim bounce. Oh, that's so unfortunate. I thought that was going to go out eventually. Mythic slamming that ball into the rim. And it goes straight up, ceiling, rim again, after Mythic bumps a guy off of the wall. And party balloons. <laughs> Here comes a friendship. Wolf and Wolf Mythic have that. That's a shot. Ooh. They, they have that, like, oh, the diagonal friendship, which I, I don't do the diagonal. I do the, the, the full T-bone. They go 45 degree angle. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Wolf doesn't turn all the way. It's, if, yeah, if think, you haven't, there's multiple times of friendships. Let's see what Mythic yeah. does here. I think that's Wolf will use that. He adapted yeah. to that just a little bit. Yeah, that's Mythic, gonna go straight into. Yeah, Mythic, Mythic does a little bit of, more of a 60 degree angle. I think everyone adapted a little bit when they changed the physics. Yep. You know, like you have to uh, actually be angled. So you have to be angled a little bit more. Yeah, you gotta do what it takes to get a collision. Those two friendships in a row, really savage against Blue Team. Yeah. Even though there's plenty of time for blue team to catch back up, it's got to be really depressing that they're uh, the one of the big reasons they're losing is uh, something that they have never seen before, yeah. possibly. Yeah. Oh, Wolf somehow manages to get that save. Wolf launches it all the way over to the opposite wall. Mythic's waiting. Mythic just slow hits it, though. He uh, probably didn't get the hit he wanted. Risk has got it into the net. Also, probably didn't get the hit he wanted. Risk has still got another one. Oh, oh the no dunk! Way. What a dunk! Mythic just had to hit it anywhere that Risk wasn't. He didn't even have to hit it. In fact, Bambi passes to Risk, but that's gonna go up to Wolf. Oh no! Bambi's got a really hard clear, but nobody is in this corner. Bambi backflips just to try to keep touching it, but now it's an oranges. Well, it was an oranges possession. What over. was that flick from Risk? I have no clue how that went so far downwards. Here comes a ceiling shot. No wolf's there to intercept by uh, infamous wolf pre-jump save. <laughs> Most people would say that's YOLO, high. but wolf is like, nah, it's just a pre-jump. It's fine. It's, it's not really that dangerous if he knows Mythic's back on defense. You know, it's the best thing he can do. Rather than waiting to go in rotation, it, it makes a lot of sense. No, because if you wait too long, the, the attacker can like, slow down the ball maybe and... You know, right. fake you out. They can set up what they want. Mm -hmm. It's a lot better to force the attacker. That's just going to go in over time. No, Bambi's got the read off of the rim. 
It was actually a very oh, nice pop considering that the rim was right there. There's a shot on goal. Wolf doesn't have enough boost to get this. In fact, he... I, was uh, Did Bambi hit the rim and then hit Wolf? Let's let's see. Yeah. Oh, I'm oh, sorry, risk. risk. Let's see. Let's watch this. Yeah, he hit Wolf so. up. Yeah. yeah. But Wolf didn't hit him down, so... Uh, it's... It's gonna be, I think, inconsequential with four goals down in a minute. It's, uh, I mean, it's not gonna matter. I mean, Wolf and Mythic did did four or five in a minute. Just a few, just last game. Ooh, that's oh, that's really close. Mythic barely getting enough of his car in front of the ball to keep that out. That's all that was needed. Risk flipping out of the way. Now Wolf. risk, uh, risk and Wolf tussling in the corner for possession of the ball. Bambi tried to get a second touch there. That could have been dangerous, but barely missed. Mythic using the angle to try to center it for Wolf, but it was just still straight over the net. So, who do you think is going to win game number three? Uh, After seeing these results, do you think? I'm I'm do thinking. Think any team has the upper hand? I'm thinking. I'm thinking. So, in my experience, the team that won, uh, that won the second game usually comes back because after that point it looks it looks like they like they understand how their team works and they they've countered it so i think i think that's going to continue happening mm -hmm. that last goal mythic just used the roll shot and the defender got rimmed so if it if it had been you know wolf and mythic that had won the first game and then risk and uh, bambi came back i would have still said the same thing <laughs> you know it's it's inconsequential Yeah, after that performance, man, I think, I think oh all Lux got this. I think uh, Mythic Pink they're Luck holding out. Mythic Pink missed with an ED. That's savage. Didn't. And, and if more, you scroll up, didn't Camber just say that? Uh, yeah. But no, but no, but the earlier one was Mythic. Um, was barely missed. Not. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. He Camber keeps going with the same joke. Nice troll. Alright, game number three. So, the winner of this goes straight to the grand final. The loser has to go to the loser's final, which is still going to be a best of three, so they get more games in, but they're going to have to knock the winner out of a best of five series, and then another one. Oh, what a oh, save! No. Bambi, so close Bambi. to saving it. Yeah, Bambi using the only save he could. That's, that's that was his only option, and Mythic knowing that was his only option and being right there to dunk it and, down. And that was that corner that Ruthless. I talked about, the pocket where it just bounces against the rim in your car, and it just it lowers the amount of height that the ball gets, and it usually doesn't go out. Mythic's got a dunk. No, he just hits it straight into the wall. Risk and Bambi this fighting. Is a really good opportunity for Blue Team, but uh, Risk couldn't utilize that rim. Bambi's gonna hit it towards center. He's actually gonna use the roof, but this. <laughs> Not the right that, decision. Yeah, that delay there gave Mythic just enough time to sneak in there and score. Slammed it straight yeah, down. Yeah, Bambi is like, oh, I got a, I got a ceiling. Actually, you're a little bit too low for that. The ball is a little bit too low. Mythic coming in, reading it like a savage. <laughs> oh, that 50-50 could be dangerous for blue team. Oh, Bambi missing it there. Give uh, his teammate enough time by faking Wolf out to take Wolf. a shot, but it no, was just oh, over. Mythic just saved Wolf's, uh, Wolf's hide there. His fur, rather. <laughs> super low on boost, and Mythic comes in to contest that. It's super helpful if you have your teammate, especially in, in soccer, if they're dribbling, and you and your teammate who's rotating back comes in and just like, Mop, nope, you can't dribble. Mm -hmm. It really helps out the, uh, the other teammate. All right, orange team both in goal. What Guys, somebody's got to contest this ball. <laughs> And they Risk both is about to show you why. At the same time. Yeah. Wolf's got that popped up. Risk puts it right behind Wolf. But Mythic's there. Mythic gets blocked by Bambi. Wolf gets blocked by Bambi. And that's is there nobody Bambi can't block? Yeah, the re the reads the reads the this angle? the reads this series have been insane from both teams. From you know, red mm -hmm. dunks to That was really teams. close. Just tagging the rim over and over again from blue team. They're gonna need to put these shots on net if uh, 
They want to catch back Wolf. up, but so light. You made a mistake there. There's your, there's your weekly John Madden. <laughs> I didn't even, I didn't even hear it. I don't know that joke. <laughs> I said blue team's gonna need to put the balls in the net <laughs> if they want to catch up. I have said no. That by accident, but you know what I meant. Like they gotta stop tagging the rim. Start making the shots clean. Because if it even, even if it hits rim and is going in, wow. Okay. As I say that, yeah, good that, goal that, from Bambi that, using the wall. Rolf, that's your introduction to the, yeah. uh, the, the one of the more, ca one of the more common caster curses. As, as you're saying something, the a exact opposite happens, like or exactly what you're saying mm -hmm. happens. Bambi was like exactly underneath the ball, so he, the ball kept the same momentum. It just went upward a little bit. I, I believe that was he a used friendship that to attempt. off the wall. Risk and Bambi might have attempted a friendship there. Oh, I missed it. Wow. Yeah, they, they're realizing that it's it's frustrating to have friendships being made yeah, against you. And their best bet is to just no fly response. all That's the way. Really Whoa! What a savage. Wolf uh, breaking the sonic barrier. Your best bet on the <laughs> friendship when you're defending is to just jump straight up high as possible. In my, in my experience. Because, yeah. you, because it has to be a straight on shot, usually. That's in the corner. Wolf opting to go for Blue's corner boost. Bambi took both boosts from Orange side. I mean, uh, their boost and their side boost. Oh no! Corner that could have been dangerous. Yeah. If that had no, been Wolf actually on wall, target. Yeah, that. Wolf's got that bopped against the wall. Mythic's gonna try to clear it from that. Bambi's there to clear it right back. Wolf's too high. Didn't read the ceiling. Risk giving it up to Bambi, but Wolf's gonna be first. Yeah, Risk has to save this. Communication. Mythics popped it up for Wolf. Wolf's gonna send it in. Oh, what a now, play! Now these, now these are the, the rank two team plays I, I see so often in our coach channel. Uh huh. That you know the wall passes and then the other person just bam. No, no way to save that. And even if uh, blue team was in position on that, even if uh, they had a guy on the back of the wall ready for a Mythics touch, I think Wolf would have rammed him. Definitely. Yeah, that, that's the thing with the backboard defense is if they're if you're a backboard offense, they're gonna bump you off. That whoa, that was scary. If that hadn't touched that waterfall to back it out, that would have been straight in. There's no way Orange Team could have answered to that. But uh, Blue Team down three goals now. They've got a shot. They got an opportunity. Yeah, there you go. Mythic jumped a little bit too late there. Had so little boost. Had to side flip out. Mhm. Mm Bambi, he didn't even jump off of the wall. He knew that that only touch he needed to score was just a really simple you be know. in the right place at the right time. Yeah, those shots are dangerous, when, especially when they're, when they're in the center of the, the hoop where it's farthest away from the wall. The back wall defense, that's where it's weakest because it's so hard to, re to read that far away and get a jump over there. Oh, risk almost getting bumped by Mythic. Oh, still in, just dangling over the orange grim. Risk trying to take a shot, but it's a little too high, just over. Hmm, this is going to be a reset, so Orange has got a few seconds to breathe. Oh, that's going to go in. No way can he get there. That's just a really unfortunate 50-50. Bambi probably not recognizing that Wolf is behind him. It was a pinch even. That makes it even worse. Yeah. Yeah, Bambi, if Bambi didn't hit that, it might have just hit the back wall, and it might have been not a goal. Yeah, I, I agree. Oh, that no. another unfortunate goal? No, really close. Wolf getting it around that air dribbler. Surprising. Wolf's it's... backwards, handing it to Mythic. Oh, the double defense. Clearing it with a pinch. Now both orange defenders are in the same place. Wolf's got no boost. Mythic's got half. Now full, but Risk has got the ball yeah. over around Ano Wolf, Another one of those, if you don't have any boost, it's almost impossible to save those. You just can't jump out fast enough. Yeah, so Orange Team managing to keep their two goal lead so far this entire series. Ever since the beginning, right? They scored two goals in the first 30 seconds or something like that. Camera There's switching, so trying to find the friendship person. Yeah, he's just tapping Y over and over again. Wolf's got a shot, but it's a little wide. Nah, I'm keyboard. Trying to read the rim, Keyb but... Keyboard is easier. I can have all my fingers on the buttons. Mm-hmm. But Wolf, just putting that down. More more goal securing. Yeah. This game, this game is not looking good. 
That's just really unfortunate that that was an own goal because he just banged it to the wall. I did. Those kickoffs though, indeed, indeed, Bambi. Like, what the, <laughs> like, yeah. Dude, it's straight up unfair. They get it right over your head. Yep. That's why the one recommendation I give to people starting in tournaments, in hoops tournaments, uh, hashtag strategy. Or pound sign if you're actually a person yeah. who's Yeah, we've got a couple of things pinned to that channel that'll really help out new players, the I D think. D6, the D6 hoops is the best, I think. Uh, have you seen Kegbaugh's video? That was really good. I thought Kegbaugh's vid new video was... Oh yeah, that was really uh, good too. Top notch. I yeah. did watch that, yep. Now as this game winds to a close, uh, Blue Team once again getting a goal from reading the rim, but... I, it's they're it's, fighting an uphill battle now. Twelve seconds to go. They, it, it could happen. It they're could climbing happen. a mountain, but it's possible. Oh no, they're, they're they're I think they're they're a little bit salty, and that that's probably not going to help them out. Because <laughs> they're, they're I feel like I feel like that chat is the kind of chat that says that we've already lost. Yeah. Oh no! Oh no! Oh, no. Oh, Wolf! Really? Wolf! This is why you don't celebrate. Look at it, Wolf. No, Wolf! What are you doing? <laughs> And then he saw the chance, and he's like, oh crap, gotta jump. Yeah. They were having some, uh, friendly chat. And I think that's what made him believe that they were, they were done with the game, but they still got a fighting chance. Bambi's popped it up. Wolf doesn't have any boost back here. If Bambi can clear it to his teammate, oh man. No. He was I, 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 I think my, my, the only prediction that's gonna, that's gonna be correct in the entirety of my casting career was that, uh, Orange Team was gonna win this. Mm -hmm. That's the only. Yeah. I get one. I get one. There's a lot of goals that game. There's 11 There's goals. So many. So many. All right. Oh man, dude, the losers bracket though. Hoops Moila Sack coming, scraping their way in the losers bracket. Uh, they lost what? Winners round three? Let me check. No, winners round four. Quarterfinal. And then they had to play five. This is their, this will be their fifth match in the losers bracket, the losers final. So maybe they'll be pretty formidable. But uh, that match is ready almost. I mean, once the teams check in. As I'm failing to spell the word loser, loser. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> be back next. No, no big dog. No, get out. Just get out. You're you're not you're not allowed to meme on me. <laughs> yeah, I uh, I'm I'm being dumb. Shush, shush. We're just waiting for the teams to confirm the scores. Canver, thanks for pointing out that that I'm totally a professional caster. Wow, guys, thanks for all the follows. There's a bunch. We got... How many? Solithic. There's four. Solithic. Oh, wow. Sun, Sun Lore. Dippy Devil. That's pretty great. Cookie Monster, one, two, three, five, four. Is it Dippy thanks Devil or follow, Dibble guys. Devil? This would be Dibby. Dibby Devil. Oh, that might be Dibble Devil's cousin or something. Have there's... you seen Dilly Dilly? <laughs> no, what is going there's on? A, no, no. There's now, a guy named Dilly Dilly. I think, that's, I think if Wolf and Nico play in the next tournament, their, their team name is going to be Billy Billy. Oh no! I've done it. I, I've given him a few more, uh, a few more ideas. What was their last one? Billy Cheesesteak. Yeah, Billy Cheesesteak. Oh, that was mine. That, that was, was my idea. That was. It's amazing. I had. A, I had a good laugh at that. All right, let's join this match. You ready? Yep. It's ready for us. Should be good. Team last minute versus Hoops Moi Le Sac. I think it should be pronounced Moi, but I don't know Hoops, if they're trying to do a Jazer where it's uh, Moi. It's pro it's Moi. I feel I feel like I've I feel like I, at one point I talked to them about it and it was Moi. I don't remember exactly, but I feel like I, I feel like I've asked them about it. I think actually I think that means hoops in the bag. Oops. Somebody Google Translate that Google for me. Google Translate. I mean, I have, I've already performed Google Translates on stream. They're pretty cool. Like some of the some of the names are pretty interesting. Well, they know uh, they know some taboo information that if you put hoops in your name, 
you uh, you're more likely to win. And that's probably why they've got Leaked. this far. Oh no, we need to oh no. Uh, take down <laughs> take down this video. Take it down. Stop. Uh, <laughs> what I expect from blue team is to be really, really quick to the ball and contest everything. But so far, they've been running out of boost to contest. I think I think it's because Bambi and uh, Bambi and Risk. Oh my God, quit it with these pennies. But uh, the the they are used to the 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 old you know high pace of last game. So they're mm -hmm. like they're playing they're playing aggressive now, and they're they're the ones boost doing. I would have called last game kind of slow paced. You know, it was really defensive. Holy risk. Yeah, that was a really good shot from the wall. Cook sent it over to Bambi. Iguan read that shot though, no problem. Here's a shot from Cook that's going to go out though. Let the count up begin on bits. Yeah, I feel like we've just. <laughs> we followed around team last minute, it seems like. Yeah. We, ever since the semifinals, they. If they win this one, we'll definitely be following them. Except oh. Cook's got the early advantage. Oh, Risk. sorry, Canberra. Risk has changed nope. to a Dominus. Canberra asked me a request, but no can do unless we restart the stream. Wait, what's what's the request? He wanted the cheers to be smaller. It was so freaking huge. That's going to oh. roll up. Oh, that's going to be really dangerous. Cook's going for a dunk. Bambi keeps it out with a 50-50. Uh, I'm, seeing, I'm seeing a 20 FPS stream. Uh, uh oh. Is that just me? I'm, I'm, I'm tuning into our stream and I, on my monitor, and it looks like it's 20 FPS. Oh, no. Bambi's trying to keep control of this, but he's burnt all his boost. Oh, risk. risk. Risk is freestyling the air while he's... Oh, man. This is, the second, a really this is the second air dribble. Or yeah. like freestyle, like amazing shot that Risk has put on that has been saved by uh, the blue team. Yeah, blue team. Maybe they they can't air dribble like that, but they can sure read him. Iguan keeping that out of danger. Cook bouncing it off of Risk's head. Uh, Risk sending it into the corner where Iguan's waiting. Oh my God, the 50-50 wins. He's got it up for Bambi. Ooh, Risk close. won two 50-50s there. That's pretty rare. Yeah, and they this were obvious. Really, really... They were obvious wins. This is really fast gameplay. It's kind of what I expected. Just lots of lots of boost taking and no time to spare. No setup. Just keep that finger on the gas pedal. Chris gonna pop it wide, giving it to Cook. Cook still got possession on the side of the wall. Pinches it with the ground, but Bambi's there. Bambi doesn't have a second touch. Iguan sees that and clears it. Oh, All three people drive right past it. Bambi's got the defense on this. Actually, Risk set it up. Kept it at a harm's way. Bambi's got a shot. I think Orange Team is uh, realizing they're going to have to slow down a little bit and set up those passing plays to score. Bambi's yeah, that, that offensive is not quite working out. The defense from Blue Team coming out strong. Walking all the amazing shots. Oh, it's so close to a demo. Cook was chasing Bambi all the way to his side of the court. Bambi didn't have any boost. Bambi's got a shot, though. Actually, a pass. Risk. Risk is uh, taking his time, though. Risk gets bumped. Gets bumped for his trouble, yeah. Cook slams it into the wall. That's also going to be really common uh, from hoops. the Hoops team, the blue team, if I had to guess. is that If they don't know what to do with the ball, they're just going to hit it as hard as they can. Try to keep it away from orange possession. Is that a is that a hoops main thing or uh, just I don't know. Yeah, that, that that's just uh they I think they know they secretly know that uh, the team last minute has a lot more control, so they're gonna use that as a strategy. To uh, loosen the grip on the control of the ball. Just I mean just playing faster, contesting everything. You uh you make up for lack of control and just getting to the ball first. And getting, uh, hoping to get lucky out of 50-50s, and uh, they get a second goal for their trouble in that regard. Bambi's popped it up for Risk, but I think Risk expected that to hit the rim. Bambi might have a dribble wow. here, but Iguan shuts him down by bumping into him. Yeah, Iguan threaded the needle between Bambi's Asia and the ball. This is really dangerous. Bambi's got another touch. It's over this time. Cook's got possession of the ball. He's going to take it slow, actually, with a shot. Risk, though, we can't keep it out. 
Yeah, Risk was a little bit too far forwards so there. Didn't get enough power on the ball in the upwards mm -hmm. direction. I could put it right behind him. What a shot from Cook. Mm. Yeah, yeah, it was a really good shot. You know that Risk feels pretty bad now because he had full boost and he, I think he really it, wanted to it, engage that it earlier. It didn't matter, yeah. Cook keeping that, clearing that from the wall. Amazing doink pass by Guan. This is going to be a dunk. Ooh, missed opportunity maybe. No, the backflip from Risk. Oh, that's, that's awful. Poor guy. A doink it's from not, It's not, it's not GG's. No. Uh, Risk has rage quit. And this is a best of three. Yeah. If only I could talk in chat. Yeah, Cook, got it right. Well, Bambi's going to keep playing. Yeah, I think I think Risk will come back. After Bambi's like, hey, come back. Oh, what a dunk. Well, they're buying time for Risk to come back. Apparently the stream oh, looks fine, it's just my computer is having a uh, an absolute death fest in, on everything I huh. have up right now. That's so interesting. It's weird because the game is, yeah, the game is low FPS-ish. It drops below 60 at times even. Best of three confirmed. Yo. Uh, thanks for all the, the bits and the cheers, guys. Hoop Squad getting in that action. Oh man, a thank you AGW. He's the Hoop Squad. Yeah. He's thanks a cool guy. Tuning. He's a cool dude. Oh, cool. He's coming back. Okay. Yeah, well, he's we'll, here. He, we'll he's wait. Here. Okay. It's probably my processor, to be fair. Uh, actually, no. Yeah, my CPU. My CPU is reading twenty six percent at forty one FPS. <laughs> uh, broken, but okay. Yo, Karma Juni, stick around, dude. I'll I love teaching people how to play hoops, teaching them all the tricks. Oh yeah. Well, we were talking about earlier, our strategy channel's got all the strategy for those kickoffs if you wanted to see more of those. Yep. I don't think Iguan, Iguan and Cook actually might know the friendships. They, Cook does. I know Cook does. I've, I've played with Cook, I've played with Cook a long time ago and he definitely knew it. They might not, uh, they might not know that. I've been calling it the Fusion now since the fusion, Kegba's since, video. Since Kegba, That's yeah, such a good name. It's dude. such a good name, it is. It's way better than Parallel. Wait, Parallel was the old name? I just called it Sideways. Oh, that Fusion was really was dangerous. Good, good name for that Yeah. Time. All right. Iguan now knowing that he's not being chased. Back passes the Cook, but Bambi's intercepting. Oh, it bounces over Iguan's head. He's in trouble now. That's going to be in. I don't think he's got an answer. Couldn't read the rim. Cook saves him. Cook's pass it down to Iguan. Iguan's taking a shot. Risk is along the back wall, though. Sets it down to Cook. Bambi's oh got a save. Oh, my God. That the, was... bo the booty save. Yeah, that, everything everything oh, played out right oh, there. No, Karma Juni. Oh, no. I was right with the world. Karma Juni just added me, and it showed up on stream. <laughs> Dude, he I... added us all. Oh, that's savage. I'll respond to that after the stream. Stick, stick around. Yeah, you got to turn your uh, Steam notifications off. I you know? did. I have to oh, turn really? the overlay off to turn everything off, yeah. Mm, yeah, makes sense. That's gonna bounce in, maybe? No! Just a little low. Oh no! The Guan bumped Bambi over there. I thought that was gonna lead to some kind That's of savage be point. Bambi's up. Bambi's up so high. Oh over my the, god, Bambi the, with the maybe. ultimate reading level. Yeah. That. Alright, it's just Risk versus a Guan. Risk pops it up, but... Or sorry, Risk versus Cook. I feel like, pops it up, but, I feel uh, like uh, Risk and Bambi have PhDs in reading. Like, <laughs> like really, yeah. it's... It's really, it's really insane the amount of the, like how fast they go up through the balls and, and mm -hmm. how many touches they can get on the same hit. Yeah, I agree. I, I bet they, they're they really dangerous in soccer. I bet they, uh... Nico! Really what are you... Possibly Grand Champ level. Maybe but Champ Nico's already eight. on my friends list. What is this? <laughs> <laughs> but it's a different, it's an imposter. Oh, what a block! Cook realizing where Bambi's gonna go with that. Just cuts him off halfway. That's too low. Cook's got no boost. Iguan, 50-50 with Bambi. It's in Cook's corner, but Cook opts to take the boost instead of the ball. I think that's the right choice. Bambi touches the wall where Risk is. Did Risk touch that? I don't think he did. 
No, he didn't. It was, was blue close. still. Uh, Cook, oh, Cook. trying to use the ceiling. Actually got really a flick close. off with that high up in the mm -hmm. air. But uh, these teams are just playing ping pong. Really, really high risk ping pong because the time is ticking down and it's still 0-0. Zero, zero. Yep. Air dribble attempt from Bambi, I see. Went too All low. it takes is just one good pass or one screw up. Man! Cook! Cook reading! Save last second. Oh no. Yeah, my, I'm feeling the FPS drops. Oh no. This Ooh, game is heating up and also heating up my computer apparently. Yeah. It's just... Ball goes to the blue side, it gets cleared. Ball goes to the orange side, it gets cleared. Here we go again. <laughs> Risk has got a double touch. It hits it straight down though. I don't think Bami can make anything with that. Cook's got a shot. It's nice and low. It's not low enough. Iguan trying to read the rim. Now he's bumping Bambi out of the way. Trying to pass to Cook in the process. Is that in? Oh, it's real low, but it's not quite in. Uh, blue team with an opportunity here if Cook can read, no. He thought it was going to hit the net sooner. Uh, Alright, Blue's got possession. They've sent it over to the oh, side no. where the orange, nobody is. Both teams bumping their teammates right now. Yeah. Here oh, comes a clear from Orange. A pinch off the wall. Not going to go in, though. Would have been too low. Pinch's got... Oh. Seemed to That's have a, a buff. Shot. Oh my god. Oh, really good save from Iguan. Pinch's have been buffed. I believe yeah. it feels like it, it feels <laughs> I don't I don't think uh, there have been any any saves even necessary from orange team in the last couple minutes it's just all been the ping pong and then orange gets a shot yeah there, there's only two saves this on this in oh man that's not good yeah there's for, only uh, two saves on the whole board and orange team has both hey did anyone find out what the what their name is in French hoops moi sack I think it means hoops, hoops in the bag. Hoops in the bag? That would make sense. That's not good for their team. They, yeah, the ping pong game just eventually, it's like a Russian roulette. That bullet finally rolled into the chamber. They responded but with a really good goal, though. Apparently there were two bullets right next to each other. In that yeah. One. That was their first shot in a long time, but they made it work. I mean, it's a very surprising angle from where Cook was. It's difficult. And... Honestly, with the angle that that shot took, Orange didn't have any time to save it. If it was any higher, oh my gosh, a return goal! I think I think Suddenly, we, we found we found the uh, the tipping point. All the shots yeah. that should have gone in have now gone in. Yes, yeah, suddenly three goals within 20 seconds. Is that right? No, 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 10 seconds. Yeah. Oh my gosh! All the action, all at the end. Save the best for last. Here comes a demo coming out of Guan. Uh, Cook's got no boost, but he's going to keep possession of this. No, it's hit straight down! Bambi. So, I, I I guess Risk is now glad that he came back. So, Bambi takes the full boost. I, I don't I don't know how he did that. That was Even looking at that. It, it like, doesn't make sense. Like, how do you get that much downwards force without it going out? He was out? blasting straight up and then flipped and hit the ball downward. Yeah. That's that bonkers. Was, I thought it was going to go out. I'm like, oh no, no way. Oh, Guan. Oh my god, the own goal. The yeah. pinch. Whoa. Might as well try. Bambi almost got that double touch. Yeah, Risk is probably really happy that he came back. You know. Hoops my bag. Hoops my... That's prob it probably means hoops in the bag. Direct. That's a direct translation, I'm guessing. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, I still don't get it, but... Hoops in my bag? It's probably hoops in the bag. Just gonna put that out there. We'll have to ask if they if they get if they get farther. We'll have to ask. <laughs> Alright, well, I guess this proves it's anybody's game. Hoops uh... my bag balls, in quotes. So this went from anybody's game to, or, or I mean, this went from risk feeling defeated and saying okay. GGs to yeah, coming I, back uh, and my, with a vengeance. I think I'm gonna have to. I don't know how I'm gonna do this. When I'm watching the stream, it's like a it's like a slideshow. But when I'm when I'm in game, I'm like, oh, it's 50 FPS. I'm fine. Huh. 
Iguan's got an opportunity to dunk this, but he hit it too low. I think he knew that hitting it straight towards the backboard wasn't going to be successful. The guy was on the back wall. He's already jumped ready for him, but um, the best he could do was, I think, launch it really quickly and follow. And Bambi sent that along the backboard. Risk had an opportunity to dunk there. I think he just misread the backboard. It's rolling up. That's really dangerous. Cook doesn't have any boost to finish it, but Iguan does. Iguan just a little too low. Oh, this is really dangerous for blue team now. Iguan, don't go get boost. You already have some. Ooh, actually. Okay, so he, I thought he was going to go get take the boost corner, but he really smart decision to turn at the back post. He gave himself a wide berth to save anything that orange team had to throw. Oh, bam, oh that's cheeky. Cheeky from Bambi using that flip to just get a little bit more height into that ball. Risk hits it to Iguan. Iguan's cleared it to Bambi. Risk is there as well. Puts in his two cents. Oh my god. I, I don't think Cook can make anything out of that this. That word sense brings back bad memories of the earlier parts of the stream. <laughs> <laughs> it's like flashbacks. Like, I'm forever scarred. Yeah. Cook's bop that straight upward, but again, once once again, like I said, I think if uh, Hoops Mwala Sack, if they don't know what to do with the ball, if they don't see their teammate and they don't have a, uh, a clear idea of where they want to hit this, they're just going to smack into the ball as hard as they can and try to keep possession away from Orange Team. And maybe that's what happened last game. Maybe that was the difference that Orange Team figured out their plan, and that's why we got the ping pong matches. Maybe they were... It was uh, strategy. Yeah, maybe they were smacking it just as hard instead of trying to control it. And they thought, maybe we can play this, the game on the, your same level, but uh, still manage to get some shots in. Mm -hmm. Makes a lot of sense, if you think about it. From what from what the last game what turned out, you know. And then it, and then at the end, it, it ended up people, like, you know, it finally came out that yeah. Blue Team had, you know, done it better. Yeah, at the end, it was a slugfest. This, this might stay in the corner for a while. Oh, no, he got it around Cook, but yep, back in the corner. Bambi's got no boost, so he's going to keep it up, and it's going to get hit back to the corner. No, oh, <laughs> Cook waited, took his time. Maybe Cook was out of boost, too. I think he was. Oh, that demo is This is open dangerous. Up. Oh. Cook can't translate that pass directly well, the bump. out into a goal. It was a bump pass yeah. right there, a pool pass, if you will. Oh, no! Oh, no. Risk! Oh, double Cook. tapping the bottom transition there. Cook, Cook being Risk toxic. See it coming. Cook says, "Nice one." What a toxic. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty rude. I don't think he saw it in his defense. Cook with a random arrow in chat. No clue. Yeah, maybe he was trying to type something and tried to back out. Like Juan using the rim to save. Uh, Cook's n opting not to contest. Iguan took a shot, but just a little wide. From that uh, from that distance, though, I don't blame him. Well, that's Bambi's got a shot. Target. Iguan's got that, yep. So once again, I think uh, accuracy is on the side of our orange team. They're putting shots on target. Like, really? But what is that shot? Forcing Blue to save. Oh, no! Cook! Yeah, you, as, as you say that, it literally happens. This redirect yeah. from Risk, he just stops. Yeah, what a redirect. Just, just stops. It's like, I got it. <laughs> I think, yeah, Cook didn't jump in time. He thought it was going to be closer to the rim and wanted to really make sure that he didn't get rimmed. But unfortunately, staying that far away from the rim meant that uh, the shot goes oh in. Oh, my God. The 50-50 Bambi. Dude, that's that's one of the first times we've actually seen one of those. There are the 50-50s where you go up higher than your opponent and try to yeah. read read the double touch. That's uh, an unfortunate side effect of being slower to the ball like that if you're Iguan. What you want is to hit the ball second and only second. You don't want to hit it back into your opponent, which is yep. what he did in that it's case. Kind of like, it's kind of like drop shot in that, in that regard. Yeah. It's exactly like drop shot in that regard, actually. Oh, what a dunk from Risk. He knew that that was Cook's only way to hit that. So he just stayed on top of it, kept possession. Risk has got a double touch, but I think Cook will be there in time. Keeping it out of the net. This is just really good pressure from Orange Team. This should be a goal. Oh, just out. I give us Blue a chance to breathe, get some boost. Get on the attack. I don't think Cook can get there in yeah, time. Cook, yeah, Bambi Cook, keeps it Cook out. turned and jumped a little bit too early. Didn't didn't give himself time to turn around. That's a really good pass, but uh, I think Risk was uh, expecting some faster retaliation. I mean, that 
It's a good bet. Uh, blue team's been really quick to save it in the past. That Bambi with a really low shot. Oh, that yeah. That man. as you said, that accuracy from orange team is really obvious at this point mm -hmm. in time. Like that that shot, all it didn't go in, but it almost went in. At that really kind precise of angle. with their cars, especially the corners of their cars. I've noticed with their little flips, they hit it exactly where they want to. Oh no, that's Hook's dangerous. Hook's got a shot. Bambi, oh, he almost used the rim again. Remember we had that game, a couple games earlier, where people were using, like, bouncing off of the rim oh, to yeah. launch themselves upward to save? <laughs> we almost had another one of those. Yeah, it rubber banded around Bambi on my screen. Mm -hmm. It's pretty, pretty crazy. Fix it, Psionics. <laughs> yeah. Bambi, even though he got demoed, he got the boost. Oh, I, I thought that was going to pay out for him. But uh, all Orange Team has to do is just keep possession. Keep it nice and safe. Risk is really far back. He, he knew. Yet all he has to do is keep the ball on blue side, and they got the win. All right. Well, it's unfortunate for Cook and Iguan, but I mean, they they came really far in the losers bracket, so there's no shame in that. I mean, yeah, it's 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 just like I saw a few tournaments ago with Rapid coming in. You know, the soccer mains that are actually you know good high level soccer mains come in and face some of the mid to high level hoops mains, and and it's kind of a fight. You know, it's it's more mm -hmm. like it's whose tactics are better, right? Yeah. So that's really exciting. I, I'm glad to. I'm excited to see where Team Last Minute will uh, will place. See if they'll get first, pull a couple games away at least from uh, all luck, no skill. We, they've proven they can. They can pull at least a game. Mm -hmm. They've had a, they've had a lot of time to practice as well. Yeah. All right. So we're just waiting for them to input the scores now, and we'll give you time to change your UI. Hey, <laughs> okay. Thanks for the follow. WTF is that damage? <laughs> what? I don't know what that is. Oh my god! Big dog. I feel like that's a big dog in disguise. I don't know. Because I feel like he said that on on my stream earlier today. Because he had oh, he, he had six nine damage. He had six nine damage. So. Yo, what's good, Zwa? Thanks for tuning in. We're gonna have a we're gonna have a repeat of uh, the winners final, right now. Yep. In the grand the, final. The first grand. No final. surprise there. For, yeah. The first grand final. We should probably explain how this works. Uh, it's kind of obvious. It's the best of five. Yep. The first grand final. Who, if the winners bracket winners, a lot of wins there. Win, then they uh, they win the tournament. But if the losers bracket win, they have to go through another grand final, double elimination, mm -hmm. like that. Yeah, you made that as complicated as it had to be. That's uh, good. Yeah, I mean, I gotta say the words, man. You gotta, you gotta fill, you gotta fill as much words in there as possible. All right, these oh, yeah. teams are readying up, so I'm just waiting for the match information and for them to make the room, and then we're good <laughs> to go. Mythic Pink Mist, that Wolf guy is pretty scary. I wouldn't want to play against him. He says about his teammate. What a savage. And Mythic Pink Mist says want one pink item per minute. Is that a re is that an exclamation point rewards I hear? Uh, Out of you, Mythic? <laughs> yo, welcome. Thanks for the follow, dude. How's it going? I think I've, I've played a couple times with you at least. And uh, JF2RL, thanks for the follow. Yeah. You guys played really well. You did. You did play, no shame you played in that. so well. Surpri yeah. Surprisingly, you know. All these soccer mains. All these soccer mains coming out and just, you know, playing so well. Like, for example, uh, Risk. But he's not a soccer main, dude. JF2 wait, plays wait, what? tons of hoops. Wait, what? Yeah. I mean, okay. JF2 gonna... and Legend, they play together. I've hoops never, I've never hoops. seen, I've never seen them around. And that's going to be my story. And I'm sticking to it. Uh, <laughs> but, ba like, for example, Risk. Like, ob I mean, these people are obvious soccer mains. But their air dribble skill is reminiscent of a pro level hoops player. Right. Mm. So let, let's see let's see if Risk can air dribble his way to victory in this game. That's going to be tough with uh, Wolf's pre-jumps. Oh no. Yo, Legend, what's good? Thanks yeah, for the follow. I, I just caught that follow, literally, on my, uh, on my stream. Alright, I'm excited for this first Grand Final game. So am I. All grand luck, finals. no skill versus team last minute. Yep. Grand Finals are always, always so wit. 
Mythic thing miss has got a clear. Risk is there. I think Mythic uh, was trying to get a 50 50. And Mythic I thought he was... just, just gave up on that ball. I think he thought Risk was going to engage sooner, and Risk just took his time. Bami can get cross to Risk. Risk trying to get a pass or trying to make that pass work. I mean, when, when you uh, said that, when you said, feeling. you know, Risk waited for Mythic to, you know, fail that, I think that's reminiscent of like a ones main. You know, seeing, seeing, like, knowing when to commit, when to just let them have the ball. Mm -hmm. Oh, my oh Wolf's got a really Wolf. low shot. There's no oh! way. What a what save. What a save. Man. I don't know if I feel And he puts that. one on of his own. Yeah. Really close. Bambi leaving that to risk. Oh, if Bambi had stayed in the wall, I think he could have passed it back to risk. But, uh, they're going to have to be on defense. <laughs> I think they've got full boost, though. Shouldn't be a problem. Wolf setting it to Mythic. I, mean, I don't think he knows what to do in this corner. Yeah, I, I wouldn't either. He didn't have enough speed to go for a pinch, and it was, mm -hmm. you know, too, too, you know, just basically too slow to do anything. Yeah. At that that point. pass wasn't going to work out. Yeah. That's a surprising a lot of force. Yeah, it, that had a lot corner. of force. I think he might have been a pinch on the corner. Well, sets like a, it up for Mythic, but Mythic oh, jumps oh, the gun too soon. It pays oh, off though. What a save! Bambi has Bambi, to go. Nice. Gets the save off. No, but now Risk has to do it. Risk, Risk keeps it out Circle strafing. But now Wolf. Oh, I think he Wolf wanted to hit the transition. He should have to keep the play rolling. Keep the ball up in the air. <laughs> Excuse me. Wolf's gonna wait on D while Mythic <laughs> sorts out his uh, sorts out his problems. Uh, Wolf yeah, pre-jumping. I think. Risk like as I mean the plays like one v one. So look, uh, I mean Risk just knows when to just not go for the ball. Mhm. Mm oh. That's really dangerous. Mythic barely. Not managing to get around and dunk on Bambi. That goes straight up. That's not quite ceiling. I think blue team reads it. Yep. Wolf's turned. Oh, Mi uh. Risk actually gets the, the behind touch there. <coughs> I thought that was going to troll Mythic a little bit. Mm -hmm. Wolf's going to wait on defense. One thing I'm noticing, I think Wolf doesn't do so well. Uh, he doesn't utilize his flips just to get extra speed unless he has to. Yeah. I, yeah, I, I think mean, it's really important that you constantly are flipping just to keep... Just if, to get enough speed, if you uh, boost just start, preserve especially. your boost. Especially uh, even if you have even if you have full boost, just you yeah. never know if you're, how much you're gonna yeah. need or how much they're gonna starve you. It, I mean, yeah. it's gonna if if you if you rotate, especially if you're rotating back when you have time to get in position and just and just flip, so you don't have to have the ultimate control of your of your car, you can just use flips to not use any boost, mm -hmm. and then leave it for your teammate, right? Mythic tries to kick that into the wall to keep it there, but Bambi was waiting and ready. This ball is going to risk now, who just got the full boost. He just booms it instead of controlling. This is kind of uncharacteristic from uh, what we noticed him do early in the previous games. You know, he was prone to, like you said, like air dribbling. But I think uh, I think maybe he knows that uh, Wolf's got his number, that he's not going to be able to get around Wolf that way. Yep. Yeah, Mythic, Mythic and Wolf have defended a lot of the air dribbles coming from both Risk and Bambi in, mm -hmm. in all of the series that they've played against each other. And I don't think... I don't necessarily think that that's a good reason not to air dribble. I think if you've got it, you should do it because usually it attracts both defenders. Yeah, it, yeah. Oh, Risk almost used Wolf there to score, or at least pass it up to his teammate. Really, really good strategy. Oh my. Oh, what a pinch. That's going to go way over the net, though. But Risk, just risk a shot. Biding his time. Both. Both orange team members on the wall yeah. ready to save that. Wolf, Wolf should not have committed there because he was above the ball. He wasn't ever going to, you know, he was going to own goal, if anything. Mm -hmm. uh, once again, we're seeing a really slow-paced defensive game where both teams are trying to control the ball and make something work out of it. Yeah, I, I mean, I always say this, but I feel like, I mean, teams are feeling each other out. Because yeah. Bambi, Bambi and Risk have been through a lot in, their, in the loser's bracket run, you know, in, in the last series. Yeah. And so I think Wolf and Mythic are trying to just feel them out, see where they're at right now. Yeah. And I guess when I say control, I don't, I don't necessarily mean like they're dribbling so much. They're just making really light taps, trying to keep the ball away from the defenders. Comes a flick. Wolf's read that. Wolf's out of the rim though. Bambi doesn't have a shot. Wolf's gonna pop it up. Wrist's got that no problem. Oh, now we're getting. Getting some ping pong action. Uh oh, Bambi's got a misstep. I don't think this is anything for our team though. Yeah. Oh no! What? What was that? That was just really unfortunate. This, this right? ricochet just... play confused <laughs> ping everybody. Ping pong wizard. Yeah. 
Oh, okay, I thought Mythic bopped it off of Risk's head. No, it was just a really clean shot. Props to Mythic, that was my fault for not seeing that sooner. Well, let's see if Blue Team can turn it around in five seconds. They're, they're opting to do a fake kickoff. I just realized how Oh no, <laughs> it worked! Oh! Wolf! Wolf just in time, coming all the way from the other side to I, save that. I just realized exactly how pink Myth Myth Mythic's car is. Yeah. Like, if he had the if he had a pink octane, it'd be even better. It, his car is still pink even if he's on blue team, which is kind of cool. Oh, because he keeps he keeps pink items on. Yeah, he's got he's got pink items, and his car is I mean it's sort of pink colored, maybe more violet, but it's close. It's close. All right, one second, guys. All right, that's better. <coughs> all right, that means all luck, no skills up game uh, yeah. one in the Big grand Dog finals. Big Dog says Mythic's car feels so tiny. Uh, maybe that's because he's got his camera settings insanely far away. Maybe. Mm -hmm. Maybe. Yeah. Maybe he found. I think. I think he actually just found a an exclusive version of the Octane. That's half the size of a normal Super Octane. I mean, it lets, it lets him like you know avoid that rim a little bit more. You know, but less prone to bumping. Yeah. Bambi getting there first, but pays the ultimate price for it. Uh, let's see. What is? Oh, Bambi was sitting on the boost pad. I was still watching his car from after he got demoed, and he's just like waiting on the boost pad. Yeah, because when <laughs> you get demoed, when you get demoed, you assume the boost pad. Hey, that's. Oh. Sorry, you, you, I didn't mean to interrupt. Okay. No, you, you assume that boost pad's gonna be there and it's not, you're just like, uh, what now? Right? Yeah. That's one of the things I look forward to when I get demoed. <laughs> the only thing I look forward to, actually. Bambi's got a small touch, but it was just a little too far out. Mythic, <laughs> Mythic doesn't know what to do with this ball. He's trying to convince Wolf to come get it. Wolf, though, hits it in kind of a dangerous place for Orange. Uh, Mythic managed to fake blue team, though, and... Blue team does manage eventually a shot. If Bam he could have got a double touch, that could have been a goal. But yeah, Bam I, I assumed Bambi was going to go for a ceiling tap there, but then when he went for the, you know the sideways one, didn't get the double touch. You know, didn't pan out in the end. Mm -hmm. That pass almost worked. Uh, I think Bambi just wasn't quite in the right position to uh, pop that, just dunk it straight into the goal. It seems like the. There's a really at least a light pressure against Orange team. Like they're saving these yeah. with ease, but no, they no. haven't been I haven't had like, a good clear. I feel yet. like it is a little bit heavy. Like look at that. Wolf getting down Mythic is still out of boost. Mm-hmm. He's just pick, picking up pads when he had plenty of time to go get a full. Yeah. I th I think Boot Team is actually putting on the pressure right now. Hey, that was a good defensive pass that I'd like to point out. Mythic uh, popped it up for Wolf. It was had no danger to him, but it gives Wolf an opportunity to clear it and follow. Oh, they're both on the wall again. They've done this a lot. I mean, it's worked out for them defensively because I think blue team, uh, their passes in front of the net haven't been so good, but yeah. that's all it takes. If you got two defenders on the back wall, <coughs> oh if blue God, team were to just make a pass out to the middle of the court where they can shoot it straight down, then the orange doesn't have a chance. Mm -hmm. They need to have someone constantly contesting it to avoid that. Yeah, especially at the high level play, like pe people know how to you know get around the backward defense. They know, how, they know how to fake you out so that you have to go to the ground <coughs> to save, to save mm -hmm. the shot correctly. Or like I said, you could try to do an air dribble attempt and you're going to force both defenders out and then uh, in the inevitable 50-50, your partner can pick up the scraps and score. That's oh, just going to go risk. nice and easy. Yeah. Risk, risk just jumped the off the wall. Mm -hmm. it was, he jumped off way early though. Yeah. He was a really lucky goal. He just didn't read the, the wall yeah, at the right he, time. He, he, he knew he that if the ball was going to go out, he had to jump then, but... He just missed the read. Uh, he, want, he wanted to turn around. Here comes a friendship. Quick. Yep. Oh my. Risk. Ghost hit? Oh. Risk. Oh my god. This, this Risk game. even got extra height to try to counter that and it still went over him. Yeah, barely over him and then Mythic not able to finish it, but a valiant attempt. Here comes an air dribble. Baby's got another couple touches. Mythic reading it though. Wolf on the back bowler now. Uh, Risk trying to make something happen, but manages to get the boost out of it, I guess. Oh, Mythic barely not reading that rim. He was he was just, a, what, a little more higher? That would have been a dunk. There's the dunk, though. Yep. I thought Wolf originally had, thought he had enough speed to get for the waterfall, which would have been, mm -hmm. a, it would have been also a good play, but that, I mean, the pass, 
to Mythic, yeah. I mean, might have might have been actually a better play. Yeah, that was a decent pass from Wolf. I think he planned on following that up, but there's no way blue team could get to that ball. I think that was the plan, and uh, Mythic could get there first, so. Finally, a passing play from orange team that works out. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we've seen so many failed attempts. Mm -hmm. I think Mythic and, Mythic and Wolf have pulled off the most success, the, the majority of the successful ones today. I, I feel like they haven't been passing much at all. They've just nope. been having, no, but going nobody, for the solo nobody else play has they, though. But nobody else has also. They get the circumstantial goals. Oh, yeah, no. as they I mean, say that. Right. I think the blue team has had some really good like mid court passes, but they don't know the finishing passes so much. You know, they don't know the hitting it into the <coughs> the corner wall, the pass to your teammate. They don't know using the rim, the net. It's just it's um, just the difference between a hoops man and a soccer man. They don't know how to use yeah. the surfaces. Because in hoops, everything goes towards the rim in some way. Mm -hmm. You know, any a, a good hoop, uh, in theory, you can make a shot from from basically anywhere, like easily, if you, if, you, if you do it well enough. So the problem is knowing how to use those surfaces to get you either a pass or a shot, and that comes with experience. You know, we'll see. What a demo! W one of the things that that shows us an obvious hoops main is or that we can we can say I think most people that are hoops mains can say. Yeah, I recognize a hoops main in about a minute from gameplay. It's the walls. Use of wall. Yeah, yeah especially the backboard. Mm -hmm. I mean, Risk and Bambi have you know learned how to get around that a little bit. They they haven't they haven't gone up on the walls you know as much as we see Mythic and uh, Wolf doing. But mm -hmm. they're they're learning how to use the ground to their. Oh, edge. this is a savage air dribble. Oh no! Oh, that was so close. He hit it. He hit it right to Risk. And Risk tried to pop it back up for him <coughs> for a goal, but that that reminds me of when you posted so a close. clip of your aerial, like where you're basically touching the ground. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like best I've aerial. Never, I've never done that before. Best aerial. But uh, <laughs> Orange team takes it. Mm-hmm. Just the two goals up. Just solid defense and counterattacks. That's what's won. That's what's won for them so far. Yeah, J JF two. Legend and I tried to pass a lot today. We we're just poo at it. A, it's yeah. all good, man. It's, it comes with experience. Uh, my suggestion is try to get the ball. Like I said, try to get the ball in the middle of the court with enough air. If, it, if there's defenders, if there's people inside the rim, inside the net, try to get the ball up into the center of the court so your partner can get up and dunk it down. Because either the defenders are on the back wall and they're going to have trouble turning to get to that ball or they're inside the net and they have to worry about the rim. And one of the best ways to do that, to get the ball out into the middle of the court, is to hit the corner. What? 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 Oh my uh, god! Thanks. While we're waiting and talking, uh, this is an upset. Because this is the second stream I've done in a row where it's been a forfeit, I think, if I remember correctly. It ended in a forfeit? I believe, I believe the last... I, correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe the last stream I did actually ended in a forfeit because somebody else had to go man that sucks that's that's uh that's savage well i guess that's gonna be an interview for wolf and mythic after this mythic yeah hey, mythic and wolf is, is it okay if we interview you guys just yeah, do a little bit of talking talk yeah. about your victory talk about your great... talk about how you got robbed <laughs> you got robbed you got robbed the glory yeah um yeah, that kind of sucks. But, I mean, it's not uncommon for a tournament to go three and a half hours. Uh, or even four hours if we have 44 members or 44 teams. That's that's a lot. That's a lot of time. It's not over? It is over, he was saying. He thought he just left. Iguan says, wait, he came back in the lobby last series. It's not over. As in their series. I, w I just stayed in the lobby right now. He wasn't there. Yeah, I'm still here. Just gonna. Oh my yeah. god, I forgot. To, I forgot to fix this screen. Also, Rip. Well, Wolf, how's it going? Rip. I forgot Pretty to fix. Good. The screen. I told Mythic to come in, but uh, can oh. he get in here? I don't think he can I get in him. here. You got yeah, Mythic, him. come in here. Just <laughs> yeah, get in here. What are you doing? Get over here. We we sent the up. Oh, what's up, guys? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's Everyone's actually actually going going Did, <laughs> nothing. Just... <laughs> little di a little disclaimer here, everybody in chat, completely ignore Mr. Swaggles on the uh, the caster board, and also that Twitch for me is wrong. 
I forgot Wait, Iguan was trolling me the whole time? Yes. He was? What? <laughs> what? Wait, oh what? my gosh. Wait, wait what? Oh, <laughs> wait, really? Wow, surprising. An actual Rocky League troller in chat. I wonder, I wonder how often this happens. But uh, you guys were great. I've been had. Yeah, you guys were really good. Yeah, I, I, we uh, rose to the level of the competition. You know, we needed to bring some extra <laughs> oomph to those last couple of games. Was, no, that that one was a lot of fun. Uh, yeah, the the games where you guys, you know, like came and like six one. I remember in the mm -hmm. you you six one them and then they came back, and it was it was a little bit surprising. You know. Um, are you talking about the winners finals? Uh, I winners think finals. I think it was the flight. The I thought fight. it was the flight that he yeah, used. the flight, and like I, I mean, stuff like that where you can, I mean, these guys, a lot of people I saw today were were soccer mains that you know are yeah. good, like grand champ soccer mains yeah. coming in hoops, and they give you a run for your money. Right? Oh, we had really good series yeah. right the entire time. The whole mm -hmm. time, to be honest, a lot of times, you know how it is when, uh, since we're all high seeds uh, of the regulars, uh, a lot of times our first few rounds can be. People who haven't been playing as long, you know. Yep. Um, um, Rolf and I the whole tournament. It yeah. was it was pretty rough the whole way. Rolf and I talked actually talked about this before the stream uh, about how the seeding worked. And usually, if you if you're at a high seed, it puts you with uh, puts you against low seed people, so that all the high seed people that are you know really good face each other at the end. And the fact that you guys faced tough competition the whole way, you know, shows how like how high level this whole tournament was. mm Hmm. Uh, hey Wolf, live casual asks, why do you use a Merc over an Octane? It's oh, best car, obviously. Okay. There we go. That's but it. Why? But but why? Be best at everything, or does it have any weaknesses? None at all. No weaknesses. No. Okay. Let me tell. Let me tell you this, guys. We got off to a rocky start. Our very first game, yeah. we you lost. Yeah, I saw. Wolf it's because I wasn't in a Merc. Merc. Oh. And it was smooth sailing. So percent. that, so that's. I was wondering because usually you, I've seen that you wait for the Merc to be grand finals, grand finals only. Yeah. And so it's, yeah. but as soon as you're like, oh, we lost the game. Oh crap, gotta try hard the whole time. Right. I mean, pretty much. It's just unlocking my hidden potential. Right. <laughs> right. It's it's going. Super I, I, I explained yeah, it. Yeah. I did. That's what I said that a few streams ago. I'm like, when when he pulls out the Merc, it's like his alt his is popped. Right. Yeah. <laughs> you know, but. I mean, usually, usually I've seen that you one turn a few tournaments you've gone Merc and then for it worked for like two games, and then it stopped working, so you switched back to Batmobile, and then you came back to Merc at the end, you right. know, like like your alt regen. I mean, but this yeah, whole it's... this whole tournament was you on fire the whole time. In, in my well, eyes, thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> what is there anything you guys think you could have done better? Um, I mean, we didn't really we did double commit quite a bit. Mm -hmm. But we normally like we were able to get back into defense pretty quick after it. Yeah, I think Honestly, what I noticed. Hmm? I, I think what say, I noticed on defense is that you were both like sitting on the back yeah, wall. Yeah, you both sat on the wall, yeah. and then you both went at the same time. Uh huh. Contested. Well, yeah, that's why I said the double commit. Yeah, yeah, but it worked, dude. <laughs> <laughs> it worked <laughs> totally. Hun hundo, hundo percent. But you guys, you guys were great. Thank you for joining mm -hmm. us. Thanks. Thank yeah, you very much. It was a, this was a really fun tournament to play in this time. Yeah, I'm glad you had like back to back friendships. You had some really sick dunks. Oh, yeah. They didn't really like the friendships. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Really <laughs> so that, actually, but... speaking speaking of that stuff, I really recommend checking out our Discord channel for like our hashtag strategy channel and mm -hmm. you know other stuff like Kev Furt po recently posted. Yeah, if anyone out there wants to learn the friendships, and they are killer when you get they're them down. They're amazing. You know, they're they're the meta. tutorials out there. Um, you know and. Rolf will teach you. I'll teach you. Hit me up. Oh, yeah. Whatever. Yeah, it's man. always fun to teach people new things about hoops. <laughs> yep. I'll, I'll, that, that, I mean, that's gonna about wrap our stream. You know, check out check out our website, ranktubes.com. Uh, we've got a, we've got a Twitter slash uh, slash ranktubes. A lot of a lot of our stuff is slash ranktubes. Uh -huh. uh, our, hey, we our hey. Reddit though. Guys, I've got an announcement too. Oh what? Oh, yeah. So yeah. So um. We decided to what we're gonna do with uh with all the European players that oh, don't have an opportunity. Oh, to play. hype, hype, hype! Yeah, we don't they don't have an opportunity to play because it's late at night and Sunday. Uh, we're gonna have uh four weeks or five uh, four weeks from now. Uh, we're gonna have a tournament where both uh European and North American players can play. It's gonna be two different tournaments being hosted by Ranked Hoops. And uh, let me get the date right. 
Kind of, it's, so is it, so it's like our old system where we had separate tournaments. Yeah, yeah, but this time we're allowing since we already have a, a separate ranking system, we already have a separate leaderboard for both. Mm -hmm. Th this way, uh, it won't hurt our numbers so bad if you know we can have and, and even say say the time doesn't work out for you. Like say, um, say you've got work or something at at late at night, but you could play during like if it was earlier, you could go join the European tournament. You know. The, our server rules are still going to be the same. Uh, it's got to be a central location. So it's going to be uh, February, Sunday 18th for that split tournament. That's that's the news right now. All right, I'm going to let you finish, but I want to give a quick shout out to my spirit okay, animal, Nico, Nico, real quick. Oh, yeah, I forgot to ask you guys. Who do you guys want to thank? I'd like to thank Nico. I would also like to thank Nico for not being available today. <laughs> oh, my God. I knew it, I knew it was coming. I just didn't know when. <laughs> oh my god what a savage jeez wow savage 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 chat disabled for one second but uh yeah, so check out our gonna drop the mic drop drop the mic on that note <laughs> you guys are out hey guys thanks for coming out yep so as i've tried to say about five times now our reddit is amazing we post a lot of hoop stuff you know have some good discussions with soccer mains about how hoops is better than soccer in uh, in multiple different ways. But uh, that's going to about wrap up wrap up this stream. See you again next week. And uh, goodbye. <laughs>